Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome back to Pine Rivers Bowling Club for the third round of the 2024 Lawn Bowls to You Premier League. And in co-commentary with me this afternoon is my good friend, Bruce Kirk. G'day, Bruce. Hey, Brian. Mate, good what a great call. game had first up, buddy. That was a great game. Yeah, great game there from uh, uh, Robbie Wilde and Gary Kelly. Absolutely, mate. And this wonderful event couldn't be brought to you, but was it for the sheer generosity of these wonderful sponsors, mate? Yes, Lawn Bowls to you, the major sponsor of the uh, Premier League Queensland 2024, supported by um, BCIB Insurance Brokers and also supported for the Bowl Show host club is Paradise Point Bowls Club and the finals weekend host club is Club Musgrave. And they're all supported also by Smith & Co, who is the Bolt Show sponsor. Thank them very much for their participation. Oh, absolutely, Bruce. They're wonderful sponsors of our great game. And, mate, the match-ups here this afternoon, it's uh, absolutely sensational. You've got um, just the young guns going at each other. And I say that, Kane Nelson up against Chris Rosanis. Yeah. Dylan Fisher up against uh, Ryan Burnett. And on this rink here... We've got Trent Healy, James Templeton, Aaron Hewson and Robbie Wilde. Up against Darren Brown, Dave Thomas, John Finlayson and young Jacob Nelson. Mate, class once again. Yeah. Eight players, yep. sheer class. Um, but, mate, the uh, <coughs> one of the ones that I think um, be exciting is that young Chris Rosanis just had a very um, big win over a great team from Tweed Heads in um, Peter Taylor. Mm -hmm. And to see him up against young Kane Nelson, who just had a good win over Aaron Sheriff. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Um, but uh, as we said previously, ladies and gentlemen, um, the managers do the draw and we just do whoever is uh, available. So this here should be a crack of a game too with uh, two wonderful skips and two great teams. So it uh, should be interesting. Of course, Jim, John Finlayson is uh, one of the over 60 state players. And, of course, this is some of the products that Lawn Bowls to you sell. Yes, they've got the Aero Bowls backpacks available in store at Manly Bowls Club down Fane Street there at, uh, at Manly. Lawn Bowls to You available in store $65. Info at lawnbowlstoyou.com.au. Thank you very much for your participation. Absolutely, mate. So the boys just having a <coughs> two end roll up and uh, just, uh, well, Capella Bar have uh, changed greens. They were. Um, over on the second green this morning and we're very successful over the very strong broad beach side so uh should be a great game you can see there's still a pretty good crowd up there on the balcony there's uh, a lot of the people here this morning i can see that they've got a way to play their their games this afternoon so it should be one heck of a battle here in this game here and it doesn't get any easier <coughs> for the Broadbeach guys because they're playing um, Tweed Eds on the other green. So <laughs> I was just talking to Ryan Bester, who's playing against Gary Kelly, and I said, gee whiz, mate, how come you always get the easy games, Ryan? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, didn't, uh, didn't Gary graft a good, uh, a good win out of that? Uh, he was down uh, in the early stages. Mm. and just grafted a win out of that. Uh, and went, well done, Gaz. It, 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 good bowling. No, absolutely, mate. I couldn't agree more on that one. Um, and as you said, just watching the way he grafted that too, I thought was absolutely outstanding, uh, Bruce. It was absolutely uh, just kept grinding away, kept looking at the scoreboard. Didn't do anything silly, but gee whiz, he played some very telling bowls. We see the players just uh, coming back this way and they'll start straight away as soon as they get back this way. So yeah, just that was what the uh, the instructions were, going over two and roll up, uh, starting at two o'clock, and then when you're finished, take a breath and then go straight into it. Ever so true. Yep. Now, just for our viewers, for a player comfortable level, it's uh, really, say, 10 minutes past two according to the stopwatch. It's 28.3 degrees and 66% humidity. Bit of a breeze, Bruce. It's quite pleasant, really. It's yeah, nice. So just down that corner down there, yeah. breeze, breeze coming around. Yeah, this here, this here with um, Dave is playing at the moment. You classify this as the wide hand. You see the wind there just starting to uh, to come across. So um, very um, yeah, you'd classify as being quite thick, really, wouldn't you? It's uh, not that much humidity, but there is a bit. A little bit, but uh, it's, it's, it's comfortable level. It's yeah. comfortable. <coughs> so, 
So once again, too, for the viewers, it's great to see uh, Robbie Wild back on the uh, bowling green again. Uh, Robbie, absolutely a champion bloke and a champion player and had a few years off, a bit of a spell and family commitments and various other things. So it's great to see a person of his cal calibre back in our great game. Well, a couple, couple to finish off with. Yeah. Just got the... Uh, uh, oh, Huey's coming up to have a, a shot there. I just noticed Huey's bowls were up there. He must have been down having a chat. Uh, it's not like Huey. No. <laughs> Much. <laughs> Nothing like Huey. <laughs> yeah, you're dead right there, mate. Absolute great guy, mate, Huey, and uh, one of the uh, legends like me. I've already had a crack at Jacob, unshaven. Uh, yeah, TV rink, he's unshaven. TV rink. Unbelievable. Uh, yeah, a great young bloke he is, mate. I was just talking to Dylan Fisher and said, mate, uh, Melbourne last night, Pine Rivers today. He said, who knows where I am tomorrow, mate. <laughs> 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 hey, good on him, mate. So uh, congratulations to him for being able to uh, play at this level, Bruce. And it's oh, all about right. all about these blokes uh, playing against the best at all times, mate. So it uh, really is good to see. G'day, Cam. <laughs> Ten degrees, is it, Cam? <laughs> hey. <laughs> See how you go. All good, James. Well done, James. Hey. Oh, and Anne Marie. No. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, not many, uh, and I can assure you that. But if you're looking for a set, bound to be something on Gumtree. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes, just go back to 1972. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> g'day, Larry, how are you, mate? And g'day, Cherie, Cherie Boston. <coughs> of course, the lovely wife of Alfie Boston... Alfie, of course, is uh, out here today, playing on the rink next door. Great bloke, Alfie. Comes from the Ballina. Oh, OK, down there. Cherry Street. Yeah. There's a treasurer down there for a great number of years. <coughs> you're right, Robbie. Yeah. They right? You're right? Yeah. Yep. Yeah. 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 <coughs> Let the games begin. Yes, away we go. I think what we should do really is go out with a ribbon and some scissors. <laughs> <laughs> Cut the ribbon. Let them <laughs> let them commence. Let them commence. Um, Carlo. Um, <laughs> hey, good on you, Anne Marie. Love to have you back on the bowling green, my dear. Carlo. Um, hi, Kane and Jacob. I tell the secret, Carla. They can't see you. <laughs> Well, I will pass on your regards to them after the game, though, Carla, just for you. OK, Trent, first bowl. Not too far away at all. I swear that swerved. <laughs> yeah, I reckon it did too. <laughs> <coughs> I reckon that kitty pulled his belly in as the bowl went past there, mate. Uh, looks like we're keeping Huey away. Having a bit of a yawn down there. <laughs> Young Darren Brown. Yes. Nice start here by Darren also too. Okay, Trent sticking to his backhand once again. Uh, it could be a little bit underdone grass line with this one. Yeah, just needed a little bit more weight. Right, Darren with his second bowl. Wasn't too far away with his first one. This one here, has it got the run? It's looking pretty good. Yeah, start to stop, buddy. Yeah, great bowl. Really nice finish. Yeah, that's yeah. an ideal spot there, Bruce, isn't it? <coughs> right, James sticking to his forehand, being a left-hander. James Templeton. 
Said one of the stalwarts from the Pine Rivers Bowls Club. Okay, David. David Thomas just going to drift just across the head. Perfect weight for what he was after. Just needs just a tad more grass with his next bowl. Hey, James. He's keen for a look at this one. Hold your head up, buddy. Oh, good attempt. Beautiful weight to bowl there from James. I think they're feeling that wind coming across there, and they're classifying that as the narrow hand, mate. Well... <coughs> it's, more, it's it's not flapping around too much up this far corner here, but I don't know what it's like down the other end. Yeah. Someone pinched the flag. <laughs> That's all right. <laughs> we'll find it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well done, Dave. Yep. Okay, Huey. Got to be around that last bowl. Good afternoon, gentlemen, from Patricia. Great commentary on this morning game. Thank you for all your hard work. And to Robbie for setting up the cameras. Hey. What? 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 I put four stands out, four cameras, put the weights on them. Robbie Stunned. be nothing without Brizzy and I. Unbelievable. Hey. <laughs> I put the leads out, but apparently, yeah. according to Robbie, I always put them in the wrong place. But anyway, let's not put them out. <laughs> uh, we're a team, Patricia. We are. Thank you very much for those kind words, my dear. We do appreciate it. Robbie goes all right for an old bloke, but he's, he's really got to be under adult supervision at all times, though, Patricia. Okay, John Finlayson. Oh, Finno. Oh, just going to run out of a bit of legs there, mate. Had a beautiful line on that. All right, round you come, Huey. Well, he's got the first part right. He's got on a pretty good line. Uh, Want to be on the other side of that, uh, Huey? Never mind. Mm. Okay, Finno, just looking for a tad more weight. He's on a pretty good line for with this one here. Uh, wants to be under little Good straight, no. And... Yep, and uh, a toucher. It'll knock her on his. Yeah, well, you know, looking at that around, I'd, I'd fancy the uh, red-white bowl on the right. Yep. Um, but uh, I think there's a, a nice, easy draw in there. Yeah, well, there's a good shot of the players that love standing around their head, don't they? You know? <laughs> What frothy ice cold beers on tap? You name it, they've got it on tap. Yes. Well worth the drive down just to find out. Yep. We'd hate to give you that information out because you'd only get jealous. Uh, come down and shout. Yes. You can pick from all the taps they've got. Robbie Wall. Robbie Wall, this is a lovely bowl, buddy. What a great bowl, Robbie Wall. Oh, yep. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Showing a bit of enthusiasm out there. <laughs> he's having a good laugh about it too, just quietly. I oh, know, I think he's scared of living day unless he had a Chris Rosanna's next door though. <laughs> I think Chris's head just went up on end. <laughs> See Mark Armstrong just played a great ball there. Right, Jacob Nelson. It's just got a little bit of oomph behind it, and he's... Uh, Holding the line beautifully. Yeah. Just starting oh. to cut now. Onto this one. Could get the result. Yep. Oh, pushed it over. Yeah, pushed it over there to um, John Finlayson's bowl. Yeah, Finlayson's yeah. bowl. Well, he's playing through that bowl there, so he could always get the result, though, uh, Bruce, mm. couldn't he? You know what I mean? But, um, yeah, well played. And Robbie's, Robbie's probably got second shot there, uh, Robbie Wilde there, uh, yeah. that purple bowl. Oh, yes.
Yeah, it comes down to Robbie's weight. Uh, come on. Come on. Yeah, good bowl. Oh. Oh, he wanted it. <laughs> James Templeton wishing it to fall. I yeah. Maybe pretty close to shot, but I mean, Jacob's got a good shot to play in there. Mm. Yeah, I think it could be shot there, just looking at it from there anyway. Pretty close. One on the left. Yeah, I think so too. Jacob's just got to actually just pump that bowl of Johnny Finlayson. Yeah. Just yeah. let it. Only got to go half a roll. Definitely in the in the area, mate. Inside edge. Oh, not oh, quite. Oh, went through every hole of <laughs> imaginable. One shot. Yeah, must have been. Must have been there for Finno's bowl because he, yep. he, uh, Darren Brown's grabbed the mat quick, smart. <laughs> hey, is that you, Blakey? Yeah, how are you, mate? I hope you keep him well up in Townsville, buddy. Friends to, regards to all our friends up in North Queensland. Mike Watts. G'day, Mike. From Abbotsworth over in Wales. In over in Wales, mate. G'day, buddy. This is the second game today, Mike. We had a great game this morning. A fantastic game of bowls between um, Tweedheads and Pine Rivers. Good on you, Blakey. Okay, Darren, I'll tell you what, he's not too far away with his first one once again, too. Uh, great bowl there from Darren Brown. Gee whiz, that's uh, good leading. Yeah, a bit of a problem with the uh, with the light, the audio, the auto, auto focus. So Trent sticking to his backhand, just trying to draw this kitty off that uh, first bowl. I don't think he's just going to make it. Oh, holding up. Well, he has. It ran oh. a lot further than I thought it would. Yeah. Good attempt. Uh, Locked in a very good second shot. Uh, Warren... Uh, Mate, <laughs> it's only the first end, Warren, so uh, the score will be up, mate, uh, when the teams put the scores yeah. up, mate. Yeah. No, 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 fine, thanks, mate. What another great oh, bowl lovely there. Lovely bowl, just moved it. Mm. Oh, it's a great bowl. Gail Singstock, hello, uh, just started watching great bowls. Thank you, Gail. Any relation to Larry? Larry Singstock, uh, basketball. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Trent, come to a good home there, though. Okay, David Thomas. Ah, oh, good. Yep, there you go. Oh, I just don't think, just quite got the run. Yeah, just a bit of uh, the auto focus sometimes plays up a little bit there, Blakey. Yeah, it's going from a dark to a light. Light, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah you know, it's a bit like us, Blakey, on a Saturday morning when we wake up, buddy. You know what it's like? Good on you, Dion. How are you, mate? Regards to Nugget. They're still holding on to that shot there, um... Darren Brown. Just a little bit wide once again. Had good weight on both his bowls there, uh, David. <laughs> hey, come on, Blakey. I know you, son. <laughs> Has he got the run? Another couple of bowls in. Hey, 
Only a blokey. Okay, Finno. Stick it to his backhand. Just wants to drop inside that front white bowl and sit across the head. He's on a perfect line to do it, depending upon his weight, but I don't think he's sent it. Maybe a bit of a shot down there, Bruce, on Huey's forehand, just to sit that bowl out of the head. Yep, roll it out yeah. through that gap there. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. I think that's the shot he's really got to play. The only thing about it, though, is he can't go too quick, because I reckon he could get kitty. So he's just got to sit that bowl with a yard on and stay. And uh, if you've got nothing to do tonight, I recommend you come down to uh, Pine Rivers Bowling Club. They've got an absolutely magnificent menu here. And uh, the hospitality is second to none. So Huey on his forehand, exactly what uh, we were just talking about. Oh, how do you miss it? He touched the giddy. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. Paul Whiteman watching from Bali. G'day, Paul. Hey, Paul. How are you, mate? Right, now. John, just looking just about, about another four foot of weight and find that gap. Yeah, he wants that gap between um, um, uh, Darren Brown's bowl there and, well, that's going to promote Darren in for probably another one. Well, Huey can go quicker now. Yeah, yep. No, just, just playing that control because they've got a couple of good catches there in the back. So he says, just get the kitty back here, please, Huey. Straighten. No. <laughs> One shot. Yeah. <laughs> well, I can see it, mate. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, all I can say is that he played it with good weight. Right, Jacob. Just trying to sit that bowl out of the head. Any movement on that white bowl be very beneficial also too. He's I think it's a bit tight with this one. Yeah, very tight. He wanted to be over two feet. Yeah, uh, mate, yeah. Right, Robbie. Ah, uh, Robert. Um, oh, mate, Robbie Wild. I think Huey's just happy playing three. To be drift with you, Robert. So take a bit of responsibility away, mate, and just sit back, enjoying playing three, mate. A little bit more relaxed. Yeah, yeah. I don't think you can even think more relaxed than Huey. <laughs> yeah, <that's laughs> can you? Right. There's only one person I reckon I've ever seen uh -huh. more relaxed, and that's Nathan Rice. Oh yeah, Nathan yeah. Rice. Yeah, cool dude. Yeah, <laughs> great bloke. Okay. Once he through that gap, he's got a great bowl here, has he? Yeah, he just wanted to be just around that one, didn't he? Yeah, I think that... Uh, who's that? That's Trent Healy's, is it not? Uh, it could be, I think. Yeah, uh, I think the, the, the bluey speck. I think it is, mate. Yeah. Right, Jacob. Pop. I'm not too sure who that the one was. I uh, think that's Trent's other ball. I think it's Trent's other... Yeah, I think it yeah. is too, just looking at the colour of them. Yeah, probably two of Trent's and then the other one... 
on the left of that, I think, is uh, that's Dave Thomas's bowl. The uh, yeah, the the speck, the purple speck. Oh, Robbie, he's just a little bit underdone grass line. Good on you, Robert. Yep, two to point. Yep. So that was, uh, I'd say those both were uh, were Trent Healy's bowls. Yeah. Yeah, I'd say they were by the looks of them, mate. Well, we pack up here tonight. I've got to drive down the coast, get up early in the morning, and I've uh, got a couple of things to do in the morning. Then I've got to drive up to Aspley, which is no more than 5Ks from where I am now, uh, to go to lunch with some friends we haven't seen for a number of years. And where are you going for lunch, mate? Uh, over at Aspley, there's a... Uh, going to their place. Uh, I haven't seen, uh, seen them for quite a while. Um, and... Uh, when we first got married in 74, Jan and I, we moved just at the same time as we got married. Vicky and Bruce, yep. who, who we're going to see, they, <laughs> they got transferred air traffic controller up to Mount Isa. <laughs> right? And they said, oh, what are we going to do with our house? We said, well, we'll rent it. Yep. I, I don't know how I afforded 20 bucks a week in those days. Oh, mate. Uh, Jesus. Obviously, your better half is working. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, said Slip us 15 bucks, would you? <laughs> yeah, so we uh, we moved into their house over there at uh, um, West Chermside, and then uh, mm -hmm. and now I haven't seen them for a while, so they're living at Aspley, so we're going to go and catch up with them tomorrow for lunch. Good on you, mate. Yeah. Should have made a tea tonight, though, but because you're already here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I could, could have camped in the car in the, in the back. back. Yeah, so just a little bit wide with that one there, uh, Darren. It's... Um, Two leads. It's their, uh, it's their loose, loose end at the moment because they've been all over it. Um, so James on his forehand being a left-hander. Had to be out a bit wide. He's already pointing out there. Needed just a tad more weight there too, Bruce, by the looks of it. Yeah. It's away nicely, Dave. Yes. Jacob willing it in. Oh, it's not going well. It's not going to get here, but it's possibly shot there. I oh, know. The one at the back might be shot. Yeah. Looks that way, mate. Yeah. yeah the, now, uh, James the has got a better trench. line on this one, mate. Here's for a bowl. Now you can pull up, mate. Yeah. yeah. That's well a be done. beautiful correction, isn't it? Now, just for uh, our viewers, in the uh, Tweed Heads versus Broadbatch game, we've got Gary Kelly up against Ryan Bester, Corey Wedlock playing Aaron Tees, and Peter Taylor playing Aaron Sheriff. There's some good friends playing against each other out there, mate, yeah, isn't there, you know? three good matchups. Oh, right here. Hey, if you're not doing anything and uh, you're watching this telecast and you live by, come on down and say good day to us. Uh, we are open for a drink if anyone wants to shout us one. <laughs> okay, Huey. Good bowl there from James. Definitely holding the one. How'd you come, Huey? Ooh, we had to be a bit wider oh than that, nice. mate. I think he might be promoting Dave Thomas with bowl here somewhat. Yep. Yeah, may have. Ooh, hard to say there. I'll just have a look at uh, Jacob. Yeah, I tell you what, if he... Oh, I think I favour that one of James, but I tell you what, it's... that You never give up a, f a flat-lying bowl, though, do you? You know what I mean? Mm. You know, has he got Hueys? Yeah, he, yeah, 
hold it out of, though. Yep. Got a couple of nice little catches there for Huey lately, haven't they, mate? You know what I mean? Oh, Huey, turn your back. Yeah. yeah. Wasn't happy with that one. No, he wasn't, mate, no. was he? I'll tell you what, Ryan Burnett's done a um, Chris Rosanis. <laughs> oh, geez, with the sixer to kick off. There we go. Well, that got that out of the way. Six nil after two ends. It's a uh, bit like what happened last time there, Bruce, wasn't it? Well, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> So down to the two skips now. Hard to say who's got shot there, I reckon. Uh, I, I'm, I'm fancying the one at the back, yep. which is James Templeton's bowl. Yep. Yeah, it does look like it's pretty mm. close, though. Burno. Burno, mate, just high five. Brendan Wilson. I think he's called for ice to put his hand in it. <laughs> <laughs> he's the slap for me. Yeah, you know, Jacob. Perfect weight for that draw. Mm. Huey's having a good look at it. Now, Huey's got a pretty good eye. He reckons they got one. I think mm. the finger went up. Yeah, that's, that's the bowl of James Templeton at the yep. back that I was fancying there. Yes, yes. Oh, don't turn yet. And don't promote this. Oh, danger. Will Robinson. Yep. Unlucky. Yep. Because that one was uh, Dave Thomas's. Mm. Yes, it was Dave's bowl just coming up there. Okay, Jacob, pretty hard to make another one here. If he could, even if he sits that bowl out of the head there, he's still going to be probably only two. Yeah, just the one. One for the Comets. Yes. Yep. So one thing I think the viewers must understand too is that the ones that don't play at this level is the amount of concentration required to play at this level, Bruce, all day. I mean, you're looking at six hours with about an hour off, aren't you? You know what I mean? Well, that's right. Well, that's over right. six hours, really, mate, aren't you? You know what I mean? Well, we kicked off at 10 and we finished at just after one. Yep. Quarter past one, roughly. Yep. And then, bang, we're back into it. It uh, kicked off at 2.02 uh, uh, mm. and away we went. Yeah. I'm talking about commentary, not, 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 not bowling, mate. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, of course, mate. No, mate. Of course, the bowlers, buddy. But it's the concentration level that they must have for this type of at this level. It's. Uh, you know, but the players are used to it. Mark Armstrong's played another bomb over there by the sounds of it. Gee whiz! I wish these people would stop getting so excited. <laughs> yeah, you got. Next door, good bowls coming in. That's Chris Rosanis's, isn't it? And then you no, that's uh, Cody Cody Garrick. Oh, Cody Garrick, but no, in the that's not Chris. That's um, no, Jesse. Uh, that's Chris over there with yeah. the hat on, isn't it? No, no, Chris is just here. Yeah, well, who's that over there? Jesse Turnbull. That's Jesse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jesse. Jesse Turnbull. Yeah. Just asking how uh, how his dad is, and he said. Uh, Daz is going all right. I said, good, good work. So, uh, Daz, if you're watching, 
mate, look after yourself, son. Missing you, uh, mate. So. Okay, Dave. Dave Thomas on the mat at the moment. Open draw here on his backhand. Yeah, great bowl there from Dave. Um, Matthew, that's the way they play, mate, so, so be it. Let's is, um, get some of the opportunity to look at the head, I guess, mate, so, you know. I personally don't do it, but if they want to do it, so be it, mate. Okay, James, just a little bit wide with this one. He's going to lock in. Ooh, not quite. Yeah, it could be. There's still needs to do a bit of work with his next one. Okay, Dave played a bomb with his first one. How good's his memory? Tell you what, it's looking pretty good. He's starting to get excited. He's following it. Did you come, Dave? Yeah, just didn't quite send it. No, mate. didn't have the run. And he still left that nice little port in there too for uh, for James there too, mate. So now James has cut his grass line down. I'll tell you what, he's played a great bowl here. Ah, oh, well done, Tempo. Well done, mate. That's a great bowl. That's a good bowl. Must be awfully close there. Well, it must be still resting on it. Uh, yeah, it looks that way, mate. There's been no chalk put on it, though, has there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just, there has been, just has went it? through and gave it a uh, coat of duco. Mm. Okay, coming down to crack an egg on this, Finno. Tell you what, look at this revival, mate. Not going to miss it by much. He's not going to miss it. Uh, pops it over. Oh. What a great bowl. Why don't you make it hard for us? <laughs> <laughs> Gee, <who is? laughs> Gee, that's a great bowl there by uh, by John, though. Like, I mean, just... Just had to crack an egg, an egg on that, Finno, and the most absolute superb, mate. That's Trent's, is it? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. mate. Now, that one there might be, um, I think, Trent's the dark one. The darker one, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Right, Huey. Trying to play the same bowl and also promote uh, Trent at the same time. Well, something's going to happen here. He's going to promote the wrong one. No, oh, well, he got it back again. <laughs> there you go. I'll just push it over there. Oh, mate, what a great bowl. That's a great bowl. So, in other words, Jacob said, uh, Fenno, how good is the memory, son? Play it again. Jeez, this is uh, this is great bowls, isn't it? Just uh, touch for touch. He wants him to because it's touching. He wants to just pop it out. He's got it and got it. There we go. Just where Jacob wanted it. There is. <laughs> that's a great two great bowls there. Yeah. I mean, that's in fact three great bowls. <laughs> that's Finno's other one there. Yeah. So uh, that'll be two. Huey, dead drawing it. Where did you come, Huey? You've got to stay on deck, buddy. Great bowl. Yep. Oh, yep, well done. That's a great bowl there by, uh, by Huey. Round to come, Jacob. He's holding that line, isn't it? I thought it was tight when he let it go. Mm. It's 
starting to duck now. Yeah. Probably just looking at a tad more weight with that one there too, uh, Bruce. Not mine Just much. to hold it on that line. Yeah, just to yeah. hold it on that line, mate. That's all. Had the opportunity to probably sit that bowl if he had a little bit more weight. But uh, anyway, the art of this game is the art of correction, my friend. Yes, it is. Yes. Okay, Robbie Wild. Beat that last bowl of Jacobs, which is second shot. Now he's on a beautiful line. Oh, this is a great bowl. He's just got to sit on Huey. Oh, gee whiz, that's... Is a, it? <laughs> is it or is it? Yeah, I can't see <laughs> down that far. There's a big post in the way. Mm. But uh, looking at it on a straight-out screen like that, yeah, I might fancy that second shot there of, uh, of Robbie Wiles. Well, Jacob, have a look for the kitty or the bowl. Yeah. Has he got the... Oh. Oh. Well, all he's, said, all he's done there yeah. is just pumped it over to Huey, but also Robbie's purple bowl. That's brought that definitely in a second shot now. Yeah. He just caught the edge of the kitty. Yeah. yeah his nose was sticking out. He just bumped it. Where did his bowl finish up then? There must be big ditches because I can't see it. Anyway, let's see what Robbie does with this one. Oh, I know. Very tall ditches. Yeah, yeah they like, are too, mate. Yeah. Oh, no. Not, actually, not the bottom part. Oh, he doesn't want the kitty. Oh, there it is. There it is. One, two. Two, and no, the other one should be the... Going to put a tape on it. One, two. They've kicked out. They've kicked two out. And I would suggest the one in the back, Jacob's bowl at the back, would be the third. Three. Yeah. Uh, I think Fenno conceded that, that other one, Brisbane. Oh, OK, with, yeah. without measuring down to yeah. Jacobs. Yeah. yeah, OK. So a handy pick-up for the uh, Pine Rivers Pirates. Yeah. Up at the Pirate Cove. Absolutely magnificent facilities here at Pine Rivers Bowling Club. If you haven't been here before, I really do highly recommend it. Magnificent uh, complex. You've got beautiful... Uh, Undercover Grease, you've got a magnificent club facilities and an absolute credit to the board and the members. What a great bowl here from Trent. Yeah, Beautiful good bowl. start. He's, yeah. He's done that a few times today. Yeah. Okay. Darren Brown. I tell you what, he's not going to be too far away neither, Bruce. Uh, if he starts to stop now, he's on a oh, cracker a, of a line. Oh. A bowl. Yep. Well played. Handy home. Oh, he's gone a little bit wide this time, has he? Mm. Yeah. Get behind. Yep. Behind will be good. Well, good backward there by uh, Darren. He's got he's got a good second shot locked in there, and he gave him best backward. So he's not thinking of his own glory. He's actually working as a team, giving the boys the opportunity to. Um Come on, James. This is a great bowl here, James. He is it going to? Well, I reckon. Yeah, that it is. That'll be second. And the Ooh. thing about it, though, it hasn't made a target, Bruce. You know what I mean? No, it's no. right on. It's still a one bowl target, mate. 
Great to see Kepler Wessels out there playing in the top team. Yeah. yeah. It's the only, I made the comment to uh, Kepler there a while ago. Uh, last time I saw him, I said, mate, I said, uh, good to see you enjoying your bowls, mate. I said, but one bit of advice. He said, what's that, Brian? I said, every time you win the toss, I said, you always want a bat. <laughs> I said, mate, you got a bowl. Yeah. <laughs> uh, great bloke, mate. It's great to see a former international cricketer. Um, yeah, he was on uh, on telly the other night. Uh, yeah. Just a, an old, some old footage of their. Um, yeah. Uh, mate, champion bloke, and what a champion athlete he's been over the years too. Uh, not many people can uh, still be talking about how he faced up to the West Indies at their peak, mate. You know what, I mean? <laughs> uh, what an absolute... Uh, it's great to see him enjoying our great game too, mate. Tell you what, Dave's not too far away. Just I thought he may have sat that bowl and flopped, but not quite. Brownie, uh, mate, there's no need for me to bring my tab for next week, mate, because I'm going to annihilate yours, Brownie, so make sure you've got a couple of hundred on it, son. At Muzzy. At Muzzy. How good. On your Brownie. We're going to confiscate the smoking area next week, Brownie, so you have to find a brand new place to sit. Oh, we're up the, uh, the, the car park end. I'm only telling Brownie that, mate, that's all. <laughs> <laughs> I want him to worry all week. <laughs> hey, good on you, Brownie. Catch you next week, son. Yeah, that's not a good, uh, not a bad spot there, actually, at uh, yeah. Muzzy. Yeah, mate. Uh, up that end up there. Yeah. Yeah, the only thing is the noise coming from the smoking area. Okay, Huey. Well, one in, one out, I yeah. tell you. Well, that's not a bad bowl there from Huey because it's still only a one-bowl target. But it does give him a bowl to rest on to get shot with that jack-high bowl that just pumped it through. Look forward to catching up with you next week, Steve. Unless you're playing bowls, you might even be in the Premier League team, mate. Who knows? Yeah, Fino straight away, mate, flipped over to the backhand to try and sit this bowl. Yeah. Oh, what what a bowl. great bowl he's played here too, mate. Look at this. Oh, oh dear. Just How out. unfortunate, Sad. Yeah. Yeah, one to point. Yes, yeah. what a great bowl, though, by uh, by John Finlayson. Well, that's uh, Trent Healy is holding, but, gee whiz, that was a, that was a, that was a good bowl. Yep. Is he going to sit inside this one here, Huey? Oh, on, the, on the side, oh. Huey. No. That's not a bad bowl there, though, mate. Yeah, good call by Jacob there, mate. Once wait to Huey's last bowl. Pretty close too, just quietly. Is he? Got... Oh, <laughs> Gee, it's bad luck, John. He's shaking his head there, mate. Yeah. <laughs> A wry grin on his, his face. face. Yeah. Of course, John used to own the Fred Fern Bowl Shop quite a few years ago, mate. No, oh, okay, over at uh, Woolongabba. Woolongabba. Yep. He must have bought it off. Uh, uh, how long do you have it for? He had it for a few years. Okay, mate. he must have bought it off Freddie Fern Jr. Yeah, yeah, I think so, mate. And then Matty Lucas, of course, um, ended up over there in the end. All oh, right. Hey, Matty. Matty Pete. Okay, Robbie Wild. The only thing he's really got, mate, is... Uh, Dead draw it. Well, or yeah. Is, or is he going to go yeah. for a bit of cover? One of the two. No, uh, no, no. He, I mean, he, he could red draw it. Um, he just doesn't want to hit the the, mm. the jack. No, it might be cover. Cover, cover, cover. 
Well, that was James that went back. Mm. James Templeton. So um, he's probably got, well, has he got best backward there? Mate? Isn't there another white bowl in behind a bit further there, Bruce, isn't there? Well, that purple speck's Dave Thomas is here. Mm. And then the green one on the other side is James Templeton. Ah, there it yeah, is. Yeah, there's that white bowl yeah. there, mate. Yeah, no, thanks, Robbie. Yeah, that's uh, uh, Brownies. Now, Jacob. Beautiful weighted bowl by Jacob mm. Nelson for what he was after. Yeah, it's going to be hard for him if he hits that blue bowl onto that blue speckle bowl to, to get it, to move it back. Yeah. It, it's... Uh, it, it's more than the draw weight. Yeah, no, you're dead right there. He's got to hit it to hit it to hit, hit it. it. Yeah. yeah. Okay, Robbie. It's a bit of bowl. Just going to run out of legs, mate. Yeah. Just a bit cautious of the fact that he couldn't he couldn't move that kitty, could oh, he? Oh, no, know? not at all. Because if the kitty came back, I mean, you had the, the two there of uh, John Fitness, and, but you also oh, had the other one of uh, Darren Brown. Yep. Okay, what have you done, Jacob? What's the damage, my boy? Yeah. No damage. He need, no, he needed a, a little bit, another 18 inches, inches of weight. Yeah, dead right there, mate. Yep. So Trent Healy. He held sway all the way through. Yep. Very rarely you get to see that at this level. Yeah. But <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. I don't think I want to be drinking with Trent tonight. He'd be telling everybody about that. <laughs> uh, great bloke. Well, Trent. then again, on the first game, we looked across off the adjoining rink and they'd swap positions. Yes. Lenny Clark became lead. Lee, yes. And she goes bang, bang. Yeah, straight away. One resting, front resting toucher That's and the other one just behind. Yeah. By about two inches. Yeah. Can happen at times. So it's said poor yeah. old uh, Kira, Kira Burke has been in outstanding form. My God, she's been playing some great bowls, young Kira, but she's had four wisdom teeth taken out this week, so she was in a little bit of pain there uh, today, unfortunately. Actually, I saw her come and get a bag there and walk up to the... I don't know whether she went along and... Mm. Is she playing in the second game? Um, not too sure, because... She's that constant bending up and down, up and down, delivering the bowl. Yep. Jeez, that's got to have her. Well, I noticed that she was holding her face there at one stage. As yeah. she walked past us, yeah. She was. Yeah. She was holding her face, mate, so... Yeah, just dropping across the head there, um, Darren. Oh, away you go, Trent. This is yeah. a good bowl. Great bowl, mate. Great bowl. Yeah. Well done, buddy. I think Ellen Faulkner could be out there in the major... So she may not be playing this game. I think I can see Ellen out there. What another great try here from uh, Darren. That's another good bowl there. Handy location there. Dan, how We're just waiting for uh, the manager of uh, Broadbeach. She's going to send us some over, mate. And um, just like to let your lovely wife know, mate, that uh, Alan came round with some uh, watermelon, some strawberries and some grapes. But unfortunately he had the lollies in the other hand, mate. And all three of us here in the commentary stream went straight for the sugar, <laughs> mate. But I did have a milk bottle, which must be healthy in my opinion. Yeah, good to see you drinking milk. Milk, yeah. yes. I had a banana. <laughs> yes, you did too. <laughs> banana lolly. Uh, Robbie was the one that just uh, ate rubbish, Dan. Yeah. Just ate rubbish, mate. Not like Brizzy and I. Yeah, those grapes. Oh. Oh. Watermelon. Oh. And there were strawberries in there too. Oh. And the crows. Yeah. What's, what's wrong with these bowlers today? Yeah. Oh, thanks very much, Dan. Oh, oh what a great bowl. Green. Yeah. No, I didn't stay with him. And, uh, Dan said Nathan Heath has replaced Kira and Alan Vidler has replaced Nathan. 
I saw him taking his bowls there, and I said, well, what is it you're doing, mate? Thanks, Dan. Oh, Ripper, thanks for that. Okay. Yeah, that must have been... It, she must have been in a lot of pain, bending up and bending down to you know, deliver the bowl, especially yeah. if, if the if the Panadol wear off. Oh. Yes, it's uh, a great attempt to try and play, but, gee whiz, it must have been very, very painful. Okay, Huey. What do you reckon? What do you reckon? Who do you reckon's got shot there, mate? I oh, I fancy Trent Healy's bowl there. Uh, the, yep. the blue one on the line. Line, yep. Yeah. Okay, Huey. Probably trying to sit this. Uh, no, he's not happy. Mm. Oh, he might roll Trent's spot. I oh, know. Going well past. It. Yeah. I think he's after to sit that white and red bowl out of the head, mate. Yeah. He'd be trying yeah. to beat that bowl anyway, not so much out of the head, but to just to even draw inside it. Oh, well, you can only improve, Matty. That's all I can say. There's your mother over there hobbling along with the moon boot on. Hobbling around. Yeah. <laughs> Teresa Armitage. Yeah. I spoke to Teresa there before. Oh, just missed that there. Finno didn't miss it by much. Yeah, I was talking to her before, mate. Always good to catch up with Teresa. Well, she follows uh, Lindsay everywhere. Yep. And in, no. No, just hit it a little bit too fat there, mate. Yes, Elizabeth, they're over on the other green. We did um, Gary Kelly versus Robbie Wild this morning, um, Elizabeth. And um, Tweet Heads went down in that game. Good bowl here from Finno. That'll be shot. Yeah, I'd well done. So, mate. Um, well done, John. Yep. Yes, Pine Rivers had a win this morning, Elizabeth. Uh, two rinks to one over a very courageous Tweet Heads team. It was um, 58 to Pine Rivers and 45 to uh, to Tweet Heads, uh, Elizabeth. But it was absolutely brilliant game of bowls, I'm telling you. So, um, Gary Kelly just uh, put on, once again, like last week, a master class display. Right, Robbie, looking for the kitty. And got it. Good bowl there by Robbie Wild. Great bowl. Played with great control. Okay. Um, Troy. Yes, Capella Bar beat Broad Beach this morning. Um, Capella Bar 63, Broad Beach 55. Now, did, where did that go through to? Uh, Not too sure there, no, uh, because Chris. I'm sure I saw... Now, um, uh, oh, there it is there. Yes, that's Finno's bowl, the purple and green... Uh, the bu uh, purple and green bowl, or blue and green, John Finlayson. Mm, Jacob. Great bowl here by Jacob Nelson. Yeah, sit up, buddy. Don't go yeah. wandering. Yeah. Well done. Well played. Okay, Robbie. A bit of pressure on him. Is he wide enough? Oh, he's going to crash into those... Uh, well, I was going to say those two... He looks like he's going to crash into all those front ones. And that's no good. Uh, bad luck, mm. Robbie. So, how good's your memory, uh, young Jacob? <laughs> I 
Hey, good on you, Bev. Oh, lovely bowl there, Jacob. How yep. long are you down for, Bev? Two and they're having a stretch on the other one, but... Yep. Uh, I'd be giving it a bit of a go too, mate. Don't worry about that. And over into the drink. And, uh, no, he may not get to make it. Three. Three, yeah. Yep. Yeah, so they were two of Jacobs, and that other one, the uh, purple and green one of John Finlayson, was in. Yeah, was yeah. in. Yeah. At least we know how to shave, though, mate. <laughs> I was having a crack at Jacob before the game. I said, look, I said, look at Finno, mate. Well shaved. It looks like a bowler. Yeah. I said, come on, Jake. You should have gone home. Had a, had a shave, mate. You know you're on the string. <laughs> he had a chuckle. He said, I bet your mum agrees with me. Yeah. Agrees with you. Yeah. <laughs> I said, oh, that's what mothers are for, mate. I tell you, well, he's not going to be too far away by the time this thing here finishes, mate. Maybe yeah. just a little bit runny. Yeah. Not too bad, mate. That's a great, great starter in that effect. Yeah, footing a bit behind. Well yeah. done. Yep. Good bowl there from uh, from Bar Brownie. Absolutely. Pretty close this, so it's uh, going to be again going to come down to the wire, a bit like the last game. It's the last game the um, Pirates just got away in the last few ends, really. Uh, but uh, it was absolutely uh, an incredible win by. Um, by Pine, and uh, of course, once again, as I said, uh, Capalabar beating Broadbeach. Uh, yeah, great bowls, sensational bowls. So, Darren, once again, Darren Brown from the Capalabar bowl stop. Got a beautiful line on this one here as it's working its way into the head. Once again, he's not going to be too far oh, away. Oh, yep, well done. Beautiful bowl. Good bowl, Darren. Kerry Cattell, go the Comets, great win over the Bulls. Oh, absolutely, Kerry. Talking to Jaden, very, very happy he's made, I can tell you that right now. So, he's out here again too, doing battle this afternoon. He's on the third rink across there. Hey, good one, Bev. Look forward to catching up with you and Rob. Okay, now this one here, has he got the run on this, Dave? He's got the line. Jeez, these bowlers are getting excited out there, Bruce, aren't they? Yeah. Hey? Okay, James on his forehand. Hold your head up and get around that. No. I just don't think he's quite got the no. run, mate. No, no legs. Yep. Okay, Dave, once again, got better run on this one. Oh, turning in. No. Oh, I just wanted to sit yeah, that bowl, mate. Just a little bit slower and sit that bowl oh, of, uh, yeah. of Darren's. Yep. Oh, James, I think he's taken the weight off this one also. Just needs a bit more weight. Yeah. Dylan Fisher just played a bomb over there by the yeah. sounds of it against uh, Ryan Burnett. I don't think Ryan looks too faced, mate. Just no, he just yeah, stolen down the road. <laughs> but that's Ryan, isn't it? Yeah, it is, yeah. mate. Through and through.
Well, Finno was a half gutted bowl there, got a straightener, <laughs> and comes in for a counter. And that's bowls. So just looking at some of the other scores there in the reserve grade, you can see it's a very close game here. Capella Bar 22, Pine Rivers 19 after 21 ends. And in the uh, other match on the other green over there, we have Broad Beach 21, Tweed Heads 14 after 16 ends. I think there could be a little of, uh, bit of venom in that Tweed Heads uh, bowling attack over there, mate, <laughs> after their loss this morning. But uh, once again, you've got... Uh, as well as Broad Beach also too. There should be a bit of venom over there. So you've got two great teams over there. So it should be very interesting. Okay, Huey. Ooh. Uh, still a couple there. One, two, maybe three. Maybe three, mate. Yeah, yeah I'm not going to call that one over there. No, I think I'll, t I'll take the... Uh, well, Fino might bring this one into play here, mate. If he bumps it hard enough, yeah. Oh, you know, yeah. Okay, Huey. Got to find that port there you can see just between those bowls. I just don't think he's wide enough. No. Nope. See, I fancy Aaron's uh, first shot there. Yep. Uh, as third shot. And, and I'll give two to Darren at the moment with red and white bowls. Oh, absolutely there, Bruce. But just looking at that, I, I wouldn't be surprised if they've got four shots there. Hard to tell at this stage, but mm. we'll try and get a bit of you. Uh, Robbie might try and get a bit of you on the side if he can show us some information. Hard to tell, <laughs> still. <laughs> yeah, that's why I favoured uh, Huey's, Huey's bowl. Huey's bowl, yeah. yeah. Yeah, mate, yeah. Okay, Jacob. Around you come, Jacob. You've got to be around these. No, he's not going to rack it. No. Huey's about to have a look, mate. Yep. Yeah, you were saying two down. Yep. Don't think he's here. No. Oh, he gave up on that well before he... Uh, Yep. Yeah, that was uh, probably halfway up and he gave up on it. Johnny Finlayson was just signalling three there. Yep. One of these needs a bump like that. Absolutely. Played it beautifully, didn't he? Okay, Huey, what's he going to do? Yeah, yeah, he's saying any touch on them. Any touch on them is just another one down. Yeah. But, geez, you don't want to go down four as opposed to three. No, you got that right, mate. Yeah. Yeah. Looking more on their forehand by the looks of it there, Bruce. Yeah, he's saying, uh, Trent Healy's saying to Robbie, can you come swing around to the jack by just missing that front bowl, mm. the black one, um, or was black speckled one. Uh, which is actually uh, James Templeton's bowl. Okay, let's see what he plays, mate. 
Looks like he's going to play his forehand. No, it's taking no, his backhand. No, backhand, so he wants to pick this gap. Come on, Robbie, got to be under that, though, buddy. Well, it's here. See, all that's going to do is just put yeah. another one in there. Yep. Yeah, four it was. Yeah, four down. Yeah, well, that just rolled another one in. That were three, rolled another one in for four. Yep. I think that's why they're trying to talk him into... Come the other hand. Come the other hand. Yeah. Right To go across a little bit, uh, Darren. Let's see what Trent can do. See if he's, mm. he's been he's been out of one or two of his bowls. At least one of them has been. Uh, he's been getting around that jack, and that's from th this game and the previous. Okay, good correction. Mm. Not coming in, Trent. Not coming in, my boy. Getting later in the afternoon. Uh, the carpet will be changing a little bit. Yep. Start to stop, Dave. Yeah, Just going to run through. Yeah, but pretty handy home there, though, yeah. mate. She's behind. Yep. So James, what have you got here? Mm. It's on a good line here. If it's just got to start to stop, and then yeah, lovely bowl, James. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful bowl, mate. Yeah. Yeah, reserves were 87 all, mate. That's right. Come on, Brownie. Oh, just short just at one short, end. Just short, mate, yeah. So, Fino, what's he got? Yeah, definitely the back one shot there, Bruce, by the looks of that. Ah, uh, the uh, toucher is, yeah. 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 Just looking at that shot there. Just be a little bit under done grass line here with this one, John, but it's a damn good attempt. Not too far away. Hmm. So, Huey, pretty close game this one, mate, really, when you think of it, isn't it? Well, like, that's I mean, right. 21-20, yep. uh, so after 19 of 63 ends. 
Huey, backhand yeah. onto the uh, Dave Thomas bowl. Yep. This way. Yes. Let's see how uh, incorrect I can be. <laughs> <laughs> well, if he heard you, the first thing you do is play for him. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Look at that. Yes. Well, at least we picked the hand right. You just got to see if that's his, what he's after. His grass line wasn't that bad. Finno, is it going to hold long enough? It looks as though he's played a lot more weight onto yeah, this. Gonna... Uh... Did he kill it? Yes, he did. And what have we got out the back? Yes, good question. Is there? Are there? Oh, Huey, you want to miss? Oh, bad luck, bud. Yep. William McLaughlin, go Pirates. Hey, good on you, mate. Hello, I hear an umpire being called. Now, Jacob, I don't think he's quite... Is he going to get through that gap? Ooh. <laughs> Makes it interesting, doesn't it? Well, yeah, when, you, when you're looking at there, um, John mm. Finlayson's got shot. Yeah. But if you take up a, a direct line up to Jacob's bowl and then go either side of those for those other two bowls... Yep. Jeez, he's got to be close to uh, having second shot. Well, he'd have to be, mate, wouldn't he? Mm. Like, I mean, I just favour that. I don't know, hard to say. Sometimes I favour that flat bowl, but Robbie has got the opportunity here now to um, dead draw it. Uh, Marilyn, that's the rules that the um, Premier League have decided this year before. What a great bowl here from Robbie Wild. Yeah. Uh, well, that's going to make an interesting, Bruce. Yeah. Um, Marilyn, the, the rules this year was uh, with Premier League um, set us up to the executive of Premier League or the committee to make... The, and They've always played uh, replay, but um, some of the ends... Uh, last year, I think there was one club that killed five ends, mm. and it was quite a uh, long game, so they decided to... Uh, Put it back to respawn, and the deal was that it's one metre behind the tee. Yep. I mean, you can put it anywhere, Marilyn, but that was the rule, so everybody knows the rule, so that's what they play to. Well, that's true. I was at the AGM. Uh, I handed yep. over the batons of the uh, uh, the uh, finance yep. over to um, uh, the Groat. Yep. And um, uh, there was a bit of discussion on that. Um and it was unanimous. Uh, I couldn't vote. I wasn't on the committee and I'd gone. But uh, it was unanimous amongst all the uh, the people, representatives there, that uh, it gets respotted on the uh, one metre mark. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, that's the way it goes, Marilyn. Yep. Like, I mean, they could really put it anywhere, couldn't they? Like, years ago, uh, just for your own benefit, Marilyn, it went to the, I think it was a metre and a half to either side. Yep. Of the line. <laughs> then that turned into a lot of discussion as that, what side did that jack go out of bounds? Yeah, when did it, when did it go out? Out of bounds. Yeah. And it created too much. Uh, so they just said, right, just put it behind the line. You know yeah. I mean? No more animosity all over Red Rover. And I think there was a lot of green keepers out there. That yeah, very happy. <laughs> very happy because they only had to put one spot down. In the old days, you used to have to put three uh, spots down. Right. And yeah. I remember when I was playing Premier League and as a green keeper at the same time and... Uh, Made I, yeah, one to Jacob Nelson there, so it was yep. Jacob's bowl that had shot. And I remember uh, 
one of the clubs said uh, to me, um, this club's no longer in Premier League, of course, and they said to me, it's supposed to be 1.5. Your spots are only 1.2. <laughs> I said, you know where the spots are? They said, yeah. I said, good, get over it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear, oh, dear. I thought, my God. So what, I'm the 30 mil out, the 300 mil out, whippy doody. And it was, yeah. it was 1.5, but yeah. they just had to have a bit of a whinge. Not like bowlers at all, Bruce. <laughs> it nah, don't me. be silly. Surprise me. Etty and Van Ruin. Good day, gentlemen. Hey, how are you, mate? He's not talking to us. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, gentlemen. Gentlemen, jeez, uh, mate. We've come up in the world. Thank you there, my friend. Okay, good starter here once again by uh, Darren Brown. Not too far away. I read with pleasure that um, later in the year, August, I think it is, um, South Africa are going to send the uh, World Cup winning team over for a uh, couple of test matches against Australia here. Is that right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, in rugby, that is. So, that'll be, uh, yeah. Well, we don't talk rugby. Rugby's here. No, we can talk, yeah. South Africa beat them. Yeah. Did they? Yeah. Good stuff. We can talk rugby. They beat us too. <laughs> we're, not Boy, talk, gee. we're not talking rugby. Italy rugby. nearly beat us. <laughs> so did, <laughs> and so did Georgia. And did Samoa know? beat us? <laughs> Probably. Uh, were they on the list? Yes. Uh, just I must admit, we did uh, help a lot of clubs get to their match-winning uh, credentials. <laughs> yeah. uh, dear, oh dear. Okay, Trent Healy on the mat at the moment. Uh not too far away from his first one. A little trail would be ideal. I think he's just going to run out of legs, just overcorrected slightly. But gee whiz, that's still not a bad uh, bowl. That was probably in. Yeah, uh, say that's the shot. So when are we playing the box? August, I think it is. August. Yeah, they're coming out. Yeah. Good one. That'll be good. Mate, love watching the spring box forwards, mate. I just love watching them. <laughs> they're mean. Oh, mate, they, I just reckon they're great. It's like an old forward pack, mate. Gee whiz. Love watching them play. Right, James. Is he just under Trent's? He is. Beautiful weighted bowl there from James Templeton once again. Yeah, lovely. Yep. All I'm pleased about is that you can't ruck with your feet anymore. Um, because, geez, I'd hate to be underneath that if the, the South African pack, or even the Pommy pack, um, could ruck with their feet. Gee whiz, there'd be carnage. I'm glad I'm not playing rugby now, mate. Oh, they, no. Because they've taken all the fun out of the game for me. Yeah, well, that's right. Yeah, they introduced referees. <laughs> oh, um, that was the worst part. It <laughs> 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 uh, uh, looks as though Ryan Burnett just played a great ball over uh, there. The, Pine boys are getting excited. As I said before, uh, talking, I was watching a game, 80, 85, 86, whenever it was, um, New South Wales Queensland match. Yep. And my old mate uh, Barry Gomisel was uh, refereeing, and yep. uh, you know, and I thought to myself, you know, he was he was disliked down in S Sydney. Yeah. Um, <laughs> vehemently, but you know, the thing about it was, uh, very honest man, technically. And fitness-wise, um, one of the best referees I've ever seen. Yeah. Um, and I can remember going and seeing referees in the, the likes of Donny Lancashire yeah. when I was a ball boy in yep. 1961, yep. 62. So what about Cole Pearce? Cole Pearce, yes. Sergeant Major Cole Pearce. Pearce, yep. Yeah, with his starched, <laughs> starched sure. collar sticking up in the air. Fair no. Yeah. Inside edge. Got him. And shot. well done, Fino. Fino. Yeah. Mate. Yep. Yeah. Remember the start shirt, mate? That's mm. The only bloke I've ever seen with a collar that just stayed up all the time. <laughs> Even when it was raining. It still stayed <laughs> yeah, up. Unbelievable. <laughs> yeah, I thought it actually held him up at the time. Still just quietly. But, I mean, a lot of uh, New South Wales people don't like Barry. Um, but because he, he refereed seven state of origins, Queensland won six. And as he says, you know, he's entitled to one bad game. Well, oh, mate, you know. But never mind, it's, uh, but, but as, it's as far as honesty, fitness and just being in the right spot at the right time, 
He was, yeah, he was exceptional. No, he yeah. was too, mate. Okay, Huey, is it going to come back in time? Not quite. It's going to come to a pretty good home, though, as long as it keeps running, and it has too. Yes, <laughs> Jacob said, don't go to that one. Don't go to that one and don't go to that one. Yep, they're all against us. Yeah. Johnny Finlayson, I mm. thought he, yeah, I thought he was going to pick that up, but no, he's holding shot. He's happy. He's got the back yeah. covered there with um, with Darren Brown's uh, red and white bowl. Oh, Huey having a swing at it, and oh, oh mate. yeah, probably about three inches away. Good effort, mm. Huey. Has you got another one? I think he's run out of bullets down there. Yeah. I just got my new phone, as you know, and I'm having fun and trying to find my phone numbers. And being tech savvy as I am, <laughs> yep. I just turned it on and pushed the wrong button and now I've got all my phone numbers back. <laughs> <laughs> so I better put it down before yeah, I break it. Don't touch it. Before <laughs> I break it. <laughs> yeah. yeah, go and put it in your bag. <laughs> don't touch it till you get home. Yeah, no one ring me, please, because I'm going <laughs> to the wrong button. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Robbie Wild, just looking at this head here, he's uh, he's got a couple of options here, really, Bruce, hasn't he? got a little trail on. Got to be careful how far it goes, though, with... Uh, with that bowl of uh, Darren Brown just in the back there with that white and red bowl. Yeah, Brownie and Finlayson at the yeah. back there. Back there, yeah. He's got to be careful because uh, Huey had a run at it. Yes. Um, but if he kills it, I'm pretty sure there's nothing behind those two bowls. I think Huey's pretty much... Oh, there is one at there. the back. I'm pretty sure Huey's got that covered, mate. Yeah, Huey's got that the back one. Yeah. Oh, oh, unlucky. Oh, no. He's still got another one, though. Now, Jacob really, his ideal shot would be to trail this off the line. Off the line, back. Truck it, or right in front of it. <laughs> Resting uh, touch of the front knocker. I think with the pace, that's what he's looking at. Oh, now he needs to stop now. Yeah, he, yeah. Just, left it, he just left it a little bit open for Robbie here, hasn't he? Jeez, keep the noise down, boys. Oh, mate. Yeah, I think Robbie just went out and warned him. Yeah. Uh, that's a better bowl. That's a better bowl. Nope. Yeah. It's like just a one shot. Yeah, I'd say it is. Yes. Mm. Gee, I'll tell you what, though. I'd hate to play for the Capella Bar Comets. The amount of high five and they do, you oh, have, yeah. you'd have to have your handy nice all night. <laughs> hey? And I find it very hard to put my hand in a, in a glass of rum and water and ice. <laughs> <laughs> just doesn't fit. <laughs> you know? I just, yeah, no, it's great to see the camaraderie and the teamsmanship and uh, just the great uh, respect they have for each other and they're egging each other on, which is fantastic to see. So we see uh, once again too, Bruce, once again, uh, the reserve grade team, Pine Rivers 29, Capella Bar 28. 28. Another close one. <laughs> nice and close again, mate. How good is this bowl, though? It's just absolutely sensational. Look at this great starter here from Darren Brown once again. Yeah, well done, Darren. Of course, we haven't had an update on the uh, main game over there. Oh, hang on, I can see the manager over there with his phone. That's Jono, isn't it? No, hang on. No. Yeah, it was Jono. Yeah. I think he was looking up the results, race six. <laughs> yeah, he just blew another 50 by the sounds of it.
Yeah, another good bowl here from uh, from Brownie, mate. Teamsmanship. It was so true, mate. That's a very true statement, that uh, Danny. They are. They're a, they're a young team, Danny, and they're um, playing for each other, which is really good to see. It's um, yeah, it's just fantastic to watch the camaraderie between them. It reminds me a lot of the old days of Helensvale with the intimidation factor. Sometimes you're scared teams. Well, yeah, I mean... Like they're clapping and high-fiving for no reason, really, but they're just doing it just for oh, the they'll just run over and give, you know... Hi, yes. mate. Give us a high-five. Oh, Berno. No. Gee whiz. Now, the difference between Pine Rivers and Capella Bar is that Berno's just come down the rink and high-fived his team. He missed three of them. Now the Octagon's <laughs> coming out. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> It's hand-eye coordination when people put up their hand. Brissy can't yeah, miss Yeah, what a great lad. <laughs> He's a great bloke, mate. <laughs> Rhino's a mate, absolute superb bloke. Joshua Beatty, how are you, mate? You should have been here. We need a around-the-ground supporter, and where the hell are you? He's over at... Uh, New Farm. Is it New Farm or, uh, or uh, Fernie Grove? Fernie Grove, yeah. yeah. Oh, where effort. it was raining this morning. Could have been here doing his job that we're paying for. Yep. You did tell him that you're going to put those dots with the. <laughs> other you send me as many noughts as you, you want, want, and I'll put the dots wherever you want it. Yeah, we'll look after you, Joshy. The tank, you're dead right, Joshy. Now it's fine. You know, I don't care what it's like now. It was raining before. You could have been here. Always making excuses, Joshy. You notice that? Something about it fined up and they played bowls instead. <laughs> <laughs> a light sprinkle of rain down the Gold Coast. So I rang Jam before yes. and uh, said, just a light sprinkle of rain, nothing. But apparently Sunshine Coast is still copping it. Is that right, mate, eh? Yeah. So Jan actually spoke to you this time. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. For the viewers that don't know, normally when Bruce rings his wife, she normally says, who's calling, please? Who's calling? Who's calling, please? What's your name? Yeah. I use your phone. <laughs> no wonder she doesn't answer it. My wife never answers it when it comes up, Brian Marshall. Ah, <laughs> oh dear. Okay, Huey. What's he going to do? Is he going to sit the pile out of the head or just dead draw it? Dead draw it. Dead draw, yeah. Is he under this? Well, he wants to finish under it because uh, that he doesn't want to move that up. He just had to be under that, I reckon, yeah. mate. Yeah, good yeah. call there by Jacob. Move the kitty to there. Yeah, bring it back a foot. Yeah, he could have done it while he was up there himself. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Finno. He again's got to drop under it. He looks. Is he? Just going to be around oh, it. Be, that's straight in there. Uh, yeah, that's why I reckon you've got to be under it, mate. For the kitty I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah, did it, uh, yeah. No, let me get fell in. Okay, Huey. Comes down to his weight. He's definitely got a better line. Uh, he's just not going to... Just a bit Oh, too he's much under it. Oh, I thought he was under it that time. It was... Yep. Well, that may be second shot. It sort of yeah, it wiggled be. its way in a little bit. Could be too, mate. Okay, Jacob, looking just to trail the kitty about 
two foot, he reckons, just to get it out of sight, out of mind. Now, he's going to drop under this bowl, but he just hasn't quite got the weight. No. It's going to be a bit of a nuisance bowl there, in actual fact, but I think it's still, it's around, it's around that one and, and under the other one there. That's it's, right. Yep. It's got a perfect little port in there. He's just actually set up to give uh, Robbie the perfect line in there, hasn't he? You see, Chris Rosanis is not breaking away from uh, Kane Nelson, mate. No, no. Okay, Robbie Wild on the mat at the moment. I think it's staying out too yeah. long. Yeah. Well, he's given himself another good backward bowl. I'd be inclined, uh, Briss, to be more aggressive towards it. Depends what Jacob does with this one. He wants to be around, but no, it's not going to turn. It won't turn from out there at all. No. At all. Well, that's the narrow hand of the two, isn't it? Just the way oh, the wind's yeah, blowing. Yeah. Even the big flags down the back down there, you can see them flowing quite freely uh, now, with the wind picking up slightly. What's out back? Not too much out back, is there? No. Uh, and it'd be very hard to kill. Oh, that purple bowl there, that's... Um, uh, whose is that purple? So that Dave, uh, Dave Thomas's bowl Dave out Thomas's the back. Dave Thomas's bowl yeah. there, mate, yes. Yep, so... Be a few down there, mate. So we'll see what Robbie's going to play this time around. He's going to go it, mate. Go for the kill. If he gets the kill, he's got a few shots there at the back. Mm -hmm. Turning. Oh, no, that's... Uh Oh, well, there we go. And probably used the pain a little bit there. No, no, one, two, was it? Three, yeah. Was it three? Okay. Yeah, see, that was... Um, Sorry, I thought that was... Um, that was uh, Finno's bowl oh, at, the, okay. at the side. I think Finno might have two out the back yeah. there. I thought one of them looked like Huey's, but no, mm. it was wrong, mate. So a handy pick up to Jacob Nelson that's leading the Capella Bar. Comets out here this afternoon with his uh, advantage over Robbie Wild at this particular stage. 14 to 6. Yeah, good starter once again here too by Darren Brown. Yeah, nice bowl. He's been setting up his team nicely with his first he couple he of has, bowls. Yeah, but don't take it away from Trent Healy. Oh. Trent's been putting some good bowls in. Oh. Uh, one of his two is, is, is thereabouts. Well, he's not going to be far away with this one either, mate. Just might cut under. Or he may just no, sit this bowl. Sit it and, yeah, well. well, he's opened it up a little bit, Bruce, so he's, he's done his job. But depends. Well, this place got another bowl, though. That's the thing. Darren, yeah. <laughs> yeah. And see Capalabar just starting to sneak away a little bit now at 32-24 over the um, the Pirates. There's a good crowd in up on the balcony once again. Roger Webb, lambs to the slaughter. Ah, uh, Roger. That's what you used to say when you used to play Robbie, wasn't it? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was Roger that said to me that he knew Robbie pretty well because he used to always mark his final games because losers had the mark. Oh, right. <laughs> so he said he knew Robbie pretty well. Yeah. Uh, go on, you, Rog. How's Christchurch, mate? Yeah. Okay, so a couple of... Uh, oh, good that's, why, that's why it's lambs to the slaughter. Yeah, Kiwi. <laughs> Kiwis. <laughs> Kiwi, mate. Kiwi, mate. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh, pick that one in one, son. Yeah. <laughs> 
Okay, David, it's a bit of a loose bowl there. Just pulling up just a little bit short. Okay, James. It's got to be a bit quick with this one, I think. Yep. David looking to add a bit more weight. He's got a perfect line on this one here. And to come, Dave. He's not going to be too far away. Lovely mate. bowl. He's just got to sit inside. Yeah. That's a beautiful out there. Yeah. Beautiful correction there, mate. Played that absolutely beautifully. Couldn't have played it much better. Come on, James. Yeah, good attempt there by James Temple. Yeah, just ran across. Now, you look at the reserve grade there, Bruce. It's 32 to Capella Bar and 31 to Pike Rivers after yeah. 33 ends. And in the uh, major game over there, we just had an updated where it's Broad Beach, 37, Tweed Heads, 32 yep. after 34 ends. Uh, that's good. Yeah. And the reserve grade, it's the Tweed Heads 39, the Bulls 44, after 44 ends. So it's pretty close all over the park, really, yeah, mate. Yeah, it certainly is. Yep. Yeah, this is it going to come back. It's starting its work its way back. Good attempt no, there. It needed to be on the other one. Yeah, six inches across and crash onto the other. Okay, Huey, what's he got? Oh, he just took his legs off a little bit and he uh, just slowed down coming in. Yeah. yeah. I think he could be a bit wide still, um, John, with this one. Oh, has he ever? Mainly yeah. his weight's probably... It's not wide in actual fact. He's come right back to the line. It's just basically his weight. But I tell you what, he's got best backward out of it, though, mate. <laughs> and Jacob's laughing his head off. <laughs> Look at... See what I mean? Look at that. <laughs> OK, Huey. He's on a better line. That is a better line. Oh, don't duck yet, Huey. Yeah, great yeah. attempt, though. Great attempt. Jacob made up his mind. Uh -oh. Right, Jacob. Let's make sure he doesn't leave much of a target. Really just a dead draw, something right in front of the kitty and count. Be an ideal shot for uh, for Jacob. Uh, could be an issue on your end, Jenny, because uh, I think, uh, how's our streaming, uh, Robbie? Perfect. Oh, I had, Robbie said we had a couple of hiccups just... Uh, Earlier. Earlier, but uh, seems to be right now. Good streaming here. Must be your end, I think. Sometimes it does happen. The internet plays up in various locations. Yep. Go to Burnett Bosler. On your dizzy. Okay. Robbie. Got a beautiful line on this one. Oh, handy bowl. Is it going to get a cross in? Mm. Yeah, what a ah, great yes. bowl. Well done. Robbie Wild. Beautiful done. 
I'll play his backhand, little trail, I reckon, mate. Yeah, just that far through the head, yep. Yeah, because you've got uh, that Darren, yeah. Darren Brown bowl there. Yeah. Two down, so there you go. They were down anyway by the sounds of it there, uh, Bruce. If you know, you just put the two fingers down. If you know, said they're down. Yeah. Oof. Now, Jacob, this should be too tight by right. Oh, a little slider here. Yeah, so Robbie, Robbie's got shot, and I'm wondering which one he's calling the second shot. Yeah, I'm not too sure, mate. Yeah, I'm, it could be the one on the right. Yeah, at two o'clock. Yeah, that's what I. It's the only one that I can see. I, I think, unless I'm misinterpreting one of the bowls, which wouldn't be the first time I misinterpret anything. <laughs> yeah, see, that's Robbie Bowl. Robbie's bowl. Robbie. Robbie. I'll say his yeah. name right shortly. Robbie Wilde's bowl. Bit quick, Robbie. Uh, no, he's no, just put the one finger up. One, yeah. So that, so that the had two that he had, that one of them must have been rolled out. But he went like that before. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but one, one of those must have been rolled, rolled out. Rolled out, yeah. yeah. Having a meeting over there? Yes. Yeah, probably. Bit of a team talk. Well, Hang on, listen here, fellas. It's two all. They're saying, should we buy the live stream team a, a beer? Yep. Uh, it's two all, and <laughs> looks like we're not getting it. <laughs> <laughs> no. no. Obviously, none of them have got their wallets on them. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, one's better than none, Nico. You are so correct, mate. Yeah, I think they had two, but one was bumped out. And uh, but you got one. Yeah, he was. I'd rather put one on my side than the other side. Here you go, Nico. Hope you're well, bud. Okay. Nico, were you managing one of the uh, Max Morris teams or? Uh Right, there's been a change. There's been a change in the Pine Rivers team. That was obviously what the meeting was about. James Templeton is now leading. Ah, oh, okay. And Trent has obviously gone to um, two, I'm assuming. So. I wish these young blokes would stop getting so excited. They're nearly <laughs> waking me up. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Round you come, uh, James. Great to see him, Curry. Great to see him with their enthusiasm. Look at this for a bowl from James, mate. Yeah, good bowl. That's two great bowls there from James Templeton. Yeah, it looks like uh, Trent's gone to two, yeah. Two, yeah. Yeah, so that's yeah, good. Yeah, move's been done by the looks of it. Yeah. 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 Just swung around by the looks of it there, Barry. Yep. Oh, slow down, uh, Trent. Oh, there's a hole there. Yep. Well, he's got good backward in there now too, mate. So he's... Uh, and they've definitely got shot. Oh, good. There we go. Um, Nico, skip and manager. Oh, how'd, mate. how'd you go this morning, mate? Did you have a win? Jesus, mate. That's two jobs for the price of one there, nigga. Yeah. Hey. Eh? Okay, Trent. Got a good line on this once again. 
And he's he gone down the side. Oh. Oh, he's just <laughs> changed it to the other side. Yeah. Still yeah. got one shot. Found the gap. Okay. Down to the thirds, or down to the skips, I should say. Robbie on the mat at the moment, definitely holding one shot. So Huey's obviously gone to skip. They've changed that too. No, I can't do that. I've, I've, I've run out of wide out. <laughs> well, just have to tell them. Get yeah. back their old positions. Get back to your old positions. Yes. Cost to be a fortune in wide out. Yeah. Yes. That's why I gave up bowls, mate. I couldn't afford the chalk. <laughs> Okay, John Fingerson sticking to his forehand. He really shouldn't have the grass line on that. Right, Robbie needs a bit more grass with this one. Looking has it got the run? Not quite. Oh, didn't make quite make it. Well, he's... I can't see down there, that end, but uh, I'd say that that uh, bowl on the right at, at about six, uh, five o'clock will be holding shot. Mm. Possibly, actually. It's hard to tell. Great bowl here for a few, no? Yeah. That's eased the damage. Another bowl in the head, too. Yes, that's James Templeton's bowl there. Yep. So it'll be uh, the purple. That'd be, be two shots anyway. Yeah, I think there's yeah. two there, mate. But. Okay, Huey. Already looks like pressure is skipping already. Come in, but uh, yeah, yeah. Someone, someone stole Huey that he gets paid more if he's a, a skip on live stream. I think so yeah. too, mate. <laughs> I don't tell Huey because when they tell him that, he seems to think if he stands in front of the camera, they can see the <laughs> Pine Rivers Pirates on the back better. <laughs> ah, great bloke, mate, Huey. Right, Jacob got a tighter line. Yeah, but if he loses his weight, he's just going to go straight. He could get shot out of this, though. He just doesn't quite oh. got the run, though. He could have sat off one of those bowls. Mm. Yeah, good call there by Robbie. Just play it with confidence. Just cut your grass line down. It's a better line. Yeah. Oh, in a little straightener would be handy. Oh, no, no. That's sort of closed it up a little bit for uh, for Jacob. Yep. Going to have a bit of a team talk here. Okay, mate, lawn bowls to you. Yeah, Aero backpacks available in store, $65. Lawn bowls to you. Info at lawnbowlstoyou.com.au. 
They're available in store down there at the Manly Bowls Club at Fane Street, 26 Fane Street at Manly. Mate, absolutely uh, fantastic bargains there. Yep. And Peter Shaw, Capella Bar Sports Club, 0401 415 915. Right. Having a bit of a swing at this, coming through this gap, he doesn't want to. Oh, just missed it, mate. Gee whiz! Didn't miss it by much. I did thought he, he he can't hit that, can't afford to hit that front bowl. Oh. He missed it, and there was probably an inch off the other end. So that looks like two. Good pick up. Here we go. Matt come up about, oh geez, a few metres actually. And thrown it to, oh you can see there, one uh, one track short of the, uh, yeah. the tee. Could be a bit wide with this one, uh, James. Can't yeah. Can't work its way back in now, though. Okay, this bloke here led up beautifully here this afternoon. Yeah, sure you come, Darren. Start to stop, buddy, and you've got a great bowl. Yep. And he has. Yep. Just gone across, yeah, 14 9 after 12. Yep, that's the score. Good bowl here by James, too. Has he just got past it? Is he yeah. going to sit in there? Yes, he is. Oh. Yep. Hard, yeah, hard to say. A few more bowls to come than. Uh, before we make a, a, a decision on this one. That's a great bowl, Brownie. Uh, he may have pushed it away from the uh, the second shot there, uh, but... Uh, yeah, he played a great bowl there, mate. Just snuck ahead for the day with Mr. Brightside, Clive Williams. Hey, Clive. How you going, buddy? Has he got it? Yes, he has, but... Oh. Probably got shot out of that, mate. Yeah, Pine are claiming it with uh, James Templeton's bowl there. Yep. So it must be just, yeah... Dave Thomas, oh, and that's filled a void there. Yep. So, uh, okay, Trent got a better grass line on this one, Bruce. Weight's looking pretty reasonable. Weight's looking really good. <laughs> he rode that in. <laughs> he did, didn't he, mate? He did. He did. Just going to cut. Which balls he going to hit? That? And I can't get over this. 
with the changes there, seeing Robbie go to the head. To win the club fours, good on you, Clive. Well done, mate. Can he hold that line? Now he can come in on it. What a great Robbie ball. Wild. That's a great ball. Yeah. It's amazing that you just release the pressure of someone. Skipping. Yeah. To, yeah, yeah. To uh, just yeah. relax on the mat. And, yeah. Uh, looks like two, because that, uh, that blue speck there, that's... Um, Trent Healy's bowl. Yes, it is, mate. Yes. Oh, yeah. Tell you what, this is not far away, though. If he misses this... Oh, gee oh, whiz. Gee whiz. Don't know how he went through there. <laughs> Skinnier bowl would have got that. Yeah, yeah I couldn't yeah. do more, mate. Yeah, yeah. Could cut down to a size three. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Uh. Oh, dear, dear fellas, calm down. Thank goodness it's only a game. Yeah. No need to get that excited. You love to have a heart attack. Good ball here by Robbie. Going for a bit of cover here, mate. Okay, he's opening it up a little bit though, hasn't it? It's really uh, mm. got himself the opportunity here. We see the humidity starting to increase too, Bruce. It's up to 70% humidity now, 26.9 degrees. So it's, uh, I think of the humidity in here be uh, yeah, quite substantial. I noticed Robbie just went and got some more water to put on the stones behind us. Yeah, that's... Shh. Yes. There we go. There we go. Right, Finno. Now, this by right shouldn't come back at this weight. No, not at that weight. That is not going to... Uh... That surprised me he, uh, he used that weight. Yep. You can see the updates over there. Uh, Broadbeast 37, Tweedheads 32. That's still the same after 34 rents. But Capella Bar 40, Pine Rivers 38 after 44 rents. That's in the Reggies, of course. Yep. Now, Huey. Looking to change his head slightly, Bruce. A little trail of the kitty would be... We're just going to sneak around well, here. Robbie, Robbie's holding a shot there. And oh, uh, yeah. I reckon they've got a couple there, mate. Yeah, because I think that blue speck, I'm pretty sure that's Trent Healy's bowl. Yep. Yep. And you know the other one, that greeny tinged bowl? That's, um, that's James. James. James Templeton. I think they're holding three shots there. It could be so. three shots, yeah. May even be four. With his back one I'm talking about. Yep. Something's going to happen. Well, well, they're holding one. They're holding one. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. Yeah. Yeah. Well, hang on, who's that one up front? That's no, they're holding uh, two. And they've yeah. got Huey, they're holding three. <laughs> Look out. Yeah. Okay, Huey. Oh, Huey, come on. Oh, bad luck, buddy. He knew what he'd done there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah he just pulled up short. Uh, could still well be. Only got one, two, four, definitely three there. Yeah, I think this is going to change things, mate. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure Jacob's not going to let him uh, get away with that. Yeah, get away with, the, with with an easy couple like that. Yes. Oh, gee whiz. That's uh, one, two, three. Still possibly. One. <laughs> yeah. I think they're going to measure it. Oh, mate, I'll like it for three from here. Very hard to tell with these uh, back cameras though at times. You'll see, that's Jacob out on the side there. Yeah. 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 Trent. Who yeah. <laughs> wants another shoe? Yeah. Three, Three it was. It was in. 
<laughs> so there you go. Yeah. He was one foot out. Yeah, Robbie knew that it was right. <laughs> yeah, of course he did. One foot out, mate. Yeah. Uh, handy pick up there by the Pine Rivers Pirates. Yes, yeah, certainly was. Yeah. James has so he's put the mat up of we way there too. A uh, bottle of things there, Bruce. So. Yeah, a number of metres off the off the tee, tee, probably. Yep. Uh, gee whiz, what have we got there? It's a tee, so one, two. Oh, geez, could be five metres off the tee. So they're slanting it, uh, just varying the length and shortening it up a little bit with this one. So. Yep. It's a beautiful complex here at uh, Club Pine Rivers. Yes. A beautiful start here by James Templeton. That's a beautiful first up bowl. Thank you, much better than that, mate. Okay, this chap here is at an outstanding game. Darren Brown, what's he got to show? Hold your head up, buddy. Ah, it's all right. That's all right. Very happy with this one. Yeah, good bowls. Well played. Okay, Darren, not quite. He's locked in a good second and third shot now, so uh -huh. he may be one down, but he's uh, he's helped his team out. Okay, Trent. Handy pick up by Robbie. He's really got them back in at the Pine Rivers Pirates too. It's well, they needed that. That's right. <laughs> now 34 all, mate. So, you know. Okay. Trent. Hold your head up, Trent. Oh, he's played got a great bowl here, Trent. That's going to join James there. Oh no, didn't quite make it short, but it's in the it's in the count. Yep. Bang bang! Oh, there we go. Still in? Yeah, it looks oh, like it's still right in. Right on the. Right, right on the on boundary the, peg. On the boundary peg. There it is there. Can't get oh. me closer. Well, it's actually on top of the uh, <laughs> the boundary peg there, Bruce, by the looks of that. So, uh. Good shot of uh, why Huey gets paid top dollar. Yeah, great ball there by Trent. Yep. Well played as we see a little bit of light uh, drizzle starting to uh, come down once again. Yeah, get rid of that if we're packing up. Yep. Well, there's no point you and I going out the rain because we'll only get wet. Too right. So we'll send Robbie up. Yeah, At least he won't uh, get his shirt dry wet. But it's, uh, yeah, it's starting to get a little bit drizzly and it's still coming from that northeast. Yeah. Oh, fall out? Yeah. Yes. What happened? Um, bomb came in. <laughs> okay. Cleared the, cleared the head, I tell you. Good looking bowl here. Has it got the run? Yeah, he wants to be on the other side. Here, keep coming, oh, keep quite, coming. Mate. No. Well, they're talking about 15 mil of rain up here tonight. No. Just looking at the oh 
It's going to be a hard one to get around. That outside one yep. of um, of Robbie's, mate. Of Robbie's, yeah. yeah. Yep. I mean, still, if you put it out there, it will always come back. Yeah, I thought they changed their hand. But got a bit of... Uh, oh. Well, there's a fair bit coming in, boys, for that there, Bruce. Oh, yeah. Jeez, I don't like that bit at the bottom. No. Where's that coming from, the coast? It's coming from Vicky Point. Oh, okay, yeah. Coming up. Between the island. Yep. Yeah, Morton there. Oh, great bowl by Robbie. A great bowl by Robbie. Mm. Yeah, so anyway, I'm starting to get. Um, okay, Finner, he's not going to. Is he got the run? Not quite. Got to be around or under that? No. Bad luck, Finner. He's had some close games in there. Hmm. Like 14 12 over on rink 13. And uh, there's what we're just looking at just then, there, Bruce. Yeah. Coming up. No, oh. oh, it's missing the coast and going around up towards uh, up to the island. Up to the yeah. island by the looks of the mate. Yep. Right, Huey. Put your foot on it, Huey. Well, better, off being, better off being there than short, mate. Yeah, yeah. He gave it every opportunity. This is, that's Robbie Wild there, yeah. yeah. Jacob Nelson, come on down. Yeah, got to be on the... Oh, did he roll it? Tough to say. Let's have a look at the... Yeah, hard to say. I still fancy uh, uh, Robbie Wall's bowl. Oh, here he's let him off the hook there. Yeah. But he had to be around that front one, mate. That's where I think the danger was. So I'll be interested to see what happens here with... Uh, I, I feel that uh, Robbie Wall's bowl... Yep. He's holding the shot there, but only a touch on uh, on Jacobs. Any touch on Jacobs will, will half a roll and will bring him into it. Yeah. Now Jacob's got a beautiful line on this one here. Comes down to his weight. Is it going to pull up? It's looking pretty good to me. What a great bowl, Jacob! Yeah. Oh, well did done. it come back on the line? Didn't come in. Just didn't come back on the line, mate. What a great attempt, though. So Pine got it. So must it, yeah, it was uh, Robbie Wild's bowl. Yeah, the purple bowl. Yeah, great bowl there by Robbie. Well played. Right, James, egging it on. Look at this for a start. Once again, just looking for another couple of feet, really. Uh, Des Wilson, who won this morning? Um, uh, who did we have this morning? Pine and... Uh, oh, Pine and... Um, Tweed. Tweed. Pine, Pine did, Desi. Yeah, yeah, Pine did. Yeah. You, you're playing away, Desi. You were here this morning. I saw you. You must be playing away somewhere, buddy, eh? Yeah, mate. Pine got up comfortably in the end, didn't they, Bruce? By 58, 40, what was it? Yep. Just, um, have to look that up. 58, 45, something like that. Yep. 58, 45. Yep. Chris Rosanis, 31, 8 over Pete Taylor. Ryan Burnett, 16, 15 over Corey Wedlock. 
And Gary Kelly, 21-11 over Robbie Wild. Oh, there you are, Desi. Hope you're keeping well, buddy. I was hoping to see you later on, so catch you next time we're up, mate. Or if Robbie hasn't packed up by the time you get back, mate, we'll still see you. And um, top side. Hi, Loza. Loza. He's awake. How are you, buddy? Keep running, keep running. Uh, yep, good bowl. Good bowl there by Trent. Right, DeLacy has put up. The uh, Outlaws are up 44 to 38 after 50 ends. Straight. Hmm. Top side. 47 51 down after 58 ends. I'd say that that bowl of Dave Thomas's has just wiggled its way around to uh, uh, take shot, but this might change it. Uh, you got uh, Trent Healy. Pretty close, just going to sneak around the back. Yeah. Just held its line, didn't it? Uh, Paul Wadley, who's on next week? Musgrave Hill. Musgrave Hill. Mate, we've got Musgrave. Double header at Musgrave, so yep. it'll be Musgrave Hill. What a great bowl here from Dave. Uh, well played. Oh, he's probably down now, though. We've got um, Musgrave and Tweed first up. Ah, uh, no. Musgrave Burley. Uh, ah, sorry, Burley. That's Burley good. first up. Yep. And then Musgrave Tweed in the afternoon. Ah. That's a uh, 12.30 start with a 4.30 start. Well, the best part about having tweed heads is that we got don't have to write it down because we know who's playing. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, that's uh, geez, that's uh, three weeks in a row with uh, tweed have featured. But I think they're tell uh, you what, Robbie, not going to be too far away from here, Bruce. Look at this for a ball from Robbie Wild. Oh, that'll be good uh, up at Musgrave. Yes, uh, we just have to kick Brownie out of his. Uh, his area, mate. A once, smoking area. Once we turf yeah. him out, mate, we're laughing. As long as he's got his uh, account lined up. Okay, John. Finlayson got a couple of feet to draw this shot. He's got a beautiful line on this one here. Weight's looking very, very good too. What a great bowl here by Finno. Oh, yeah. Lovely. Yep. That's a great bowl. bowl. Little knocker and uh, made two out of it, according to Jake. Uh, here be the uh, that purple on the left-hand side. Yeah, yep. The, which was um, uh, Dave Thomas's bowl. Oh, look, Andy's on board, mate. Andy Thompson. G'day, Andy, over at Devon in the United Kingdom. Ooh. Yes. Yeah, good to have you on board, Andy. Oh, the players calm down, <laughs> fellas. God. No need to be that loud. Yeah, Paul, I had to look at that twice, mate, because you, you put up there, uh, Des Wilson put who won this morning, and I thought Paul Wadley said who won next week. <laughs> who won next week? <laughs> we're, mate. we're pretty good, but we ain't that good, mate. Yeah, Mate, if you, know who, on. if you want, know who won next week, can you tell us what's going to win race three, please, mate? Yeah. We won't tell anyone else, trust me. Yeah, We'll, we'll keep us, it quiet. Give us the lotto numbers. Well, it's even better. Yeah. Joe Franzi. G'day, buddy. On you, Joe. Okay, Huey. Got to beat that last bowl of Finno's, mate. Well... I don't know. Uh, Jacob put up two fingers, but I don't know. Do you reckon? 
I'm trying to work Robbie out. Warren. I reckon Robbie's purple bowl could be. Yeah, well, that's, that was the. Uh, I reckon that could be second shot, mate. Well, if Finno's got f shot, the one at seven o'clock below it, I think his second shot, the purple bowl there. Yep. Oh, and he's that'll just be not quite uh, there with that one, unfortunately. And that's Dave Thomas's bowl, so yeah. could well be two there yep. to. Uh, uh, to Kipalaba. Yep. Now in the reserve grade over at uh, the Bulls versus Tweed Heads, it is 51 to the Offsprays and 61 to the Bulls, and that's on 61 ends. In the main game, it's 48 to Broadbeach and 41 to Tweed Heads after 49 ends. Mm -hmm. And in the reserve grade here, it's 48 to Capalabar and 45 to Pine after 52 ends. So we've got some pretty close games all over the place. All around, we've, yeah. We've got Capalabar in front here, 38 to 35. Still a bit too quick for Huey. Yeah. Yeah, that bowl there is worth a few. Jacob's just worked that out. Mm. <laughs> I don't think it's worth that many because you've got um, um, James Templeton's probably got, oh, I don't know, maybe third, maybe fourth shot. Who knows? But we're about to find out. I think Robbie Wild. I reckon Robbie's got second shot there, mate. Uh, the purple bowl. Yeah, I reckon that's, yeah. Yep. that's holding them out of a couple, I reckon. No. Uh, Turn in, Jacob. No. Not there, mate. No. What'd they say? Oh, they're having a bit of a joke, those two, and uh, forgot to tell anyone else. <laughs> well, obviously, they're not talking to Robbie. There you two. go, 16-3, so it would have been two to Jacob. Well. Yep. Rain getting a little bit steadier here at the moment. Yeah. Humidity rising, it's now 73% humidity. It's 26.2 degrees and 73% humidity. Okay, Darren, what a great starter by uh, Darren Brown. Yeah, well done. Yeah, great he's been starter. thereabouts all day. Ooh, he has all been. afternoon, I should say. He has been, mate. Yeah. Yes, yes, he's uh, he has led up pretty well, mate. Just going to sneak around the back with this one by the looks of it. Uh, Keep coming. Yep. Get behind, that's the main yep. thing. There's the rain out there, so you can see a good shot of the uh, the rain falling outside. Okay, James. Okay, Dave. Dave Thomas, good shot of Dave's delivery. Yep. Up the mighty wombat says Joshua. Ah, the uh, you won on three rinks. Well done, Joshy. Yes, mate. Well, you you went through where uh, you uh, forgone a full day's pay, Josh, over here with us, being a raving reporter. Okay. 
Not far away, just going to miss. Yeah, good attempt there by Trent. Just kept running though, didn't it? I reckon now you notice it getting a bit cooler. Hmm. And uh, you see the green start picking up a little bit in pace. Oh, hold your head out there. Well, that's not one of James's up. That's knocked him up for second shot, mate. Yeah, yep. Uh, the greenish back one, yep, yes. by all means. Straight, straight, straight. Well, uh, there's two ways to do it, and that was the other one. Well, he dropped yeah. his head on that one there, mate, but that's bowls, mate. Yeah. yeah. That's bowls. That's what happens, my friend. Fino says, what have I got to do? I said, well, mate, do the same. That'll teach him. Well, I mean, Fino's got... Uh He's got a good draw. Th th those two bowls that are up straight up the line there. Yeah. Are, uh, um. Andrews, yeah, he looks like he is, yeah. Yeah. Shot. But. Stuck it out anyway, mate. It's out in the open. Well, yeah, and well, he's. Uh, Finno's got another one anyway. Yeah. yeah. Right, Robbie. Got a pretty good line on this one here. Underneath Finno. Or around. <laughs> That's the other way around. Uh, geez, I'd, I bet you'd love to have come in under that one. Yeah. Yeah. Keep it coming, John. Just yeah. going to pull on. Just going to run out of legs oh, there, mate. Oh, that's a shame. Had a perfect line once again, didn't he? Oh, and Dylan just played a great shot over there by the sounds of it. Hmm. Yeah, Robbie underdone. Okay, Jacob. Just got to really beat. Um, yeah. Off the, the the previous one, which was uh, Finno, took his legs off his second one. Round you come. Wants to finish He's under in that. There. He's there. Yeah. Oh, see. Well, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just see the, the anguish look on his face. Yeah. Just no legs. Oh, someone's in a bit of a hurry. Yeah. The mighty Francis Road roundabout. Yep. Okay, Huey, trying to find this port down through here. Yes, he, if he can come under those and, and, and run a line towards that bowl of finish, that's it there. Oh, mate, what a bowl. Yeah. What a bowl. Yeah. 
Well done, Huey. Yeah, well played, mate. Yeah. And I think that's probably the same line that uh, that Jacobs. Well, he has. Yeah, he had to get because the other side's blocked a billio, and he just couldn't get in there. Oh, you got to miss all this, uh, Jacob. No, bad luck, buddy. Yeah, little touches four, he's saying. Can't don't know where that would be because that's Finno's bowl out there. Oh, Huey, 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 Huey. Oh. So out to Jacob's closest there. That's, uh, and then back to the purple bowl there is, uh, oh, I might go the other side over there to uh, uh, to uh, Trent Healy's bowl. Yep. No, not go the quite, other way mate. to Trent Healy's. This is Trent's here. Yeah. Two, wasn't it? Two. Yeah. I, I, Two. Yeah. yeah. Thanks, mate. Thanks, Robbie. Mr. Lovell. The comments have been pretty slow this afternoon, mate. Oh, I think it's... Uh, I'm just looking just to see if I'm missing any. I think I must be missing some, in my opinion. Yeah, I go Sorry? on to... Yeah. yeah. I jump on and do a... Like a refresh through the... Yeah. Uh, through the overview there, but... Uh, this one seem to. Uh, oh, there you go. Oh, it's heap of them. Hmm. Good day, Nathan. Um, Nathan, yeah, they changed positions, mate. Good day, Kelly. How are you? It's pouring rain on Tamri Mountain all day. Oh, what a great bowl there once again by uh, Darren Brown. Gee whiz. As we said, uh, Darren's been putting them in there, yeah. and uh, but don't take it away from well. It was Trent Healy to start with. Uh, they've James over to uh, James Templeton now. Come on, James. He's what a oh, great attempt. Just a bit of a wiggle at the end there. And uh, um, yeah. Zachary, um, mate, the the lead and the second swap because, um, as you can see from the start of the game, you can see that uh, Trent Healy's playing two now, and James Templeton's leading, and Huey and Robbie Wild swap positions also, which they're allowed to do in Premier League, mate. Yep. I'll tell you what, Br Brownie, once again, yeah. just going to pull up a tad short. From my memory of the conditions of play, they can change at the same time, but can't change back. No. But no. they can also... I'm not too sure whether they can change... You can do two changes, like um, second for skip, and then a couple of ends later... Um, I think it's all got to be done in one. I'm not too yeah, sure, but uh, that way, mate. correct me if I'm wrong, ladies yep. and gentlemen. Uh, I've asked uh, Doge uh, to s to get Baker, uh, Shawnee Baker, to send a copy of the conditions of play through to... Uh, oh. I've got a copy of the old ones, but unfortunately uh, that was mm. last year's. No, fair enough, gee, that was unlucky. Just found that gap. G'day, yeah. Vince. Good to have you back on board. Thanks, Richard. Scott Dagwell from Queen Bien. He's off to Queen Bien Bowling Club. 90th dinner. Oh, OK, mate. 90th anniversary. Gee whiz. Oh, I'll tell you what. If you've got any leftover food, mate, give us a call. Yeah. <laughs> and who's that Simon Pitt watching from Julia Creek? Oh. Julia Creek. Gee, I can't even remember the last time I went through Julia Creek. Right. It was back in probably 1970. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, a bit quicker with this one. Well, oh, well done, James Templeton. <laughs> Showing great skill there. <laughs> great skill. 
<laughs> G'day, Elaine. The lolly lady is watching. <laughs> <laughs> Good on you. The lolly lady. <laughs> yeah. Hang on, you, Elaine. Yeah. Okay, Dave, has he got the run? He's around. Oh, he's just going to pull up. What a great head we've got building here, though, uh, Bruce. Yeah, that's good. You remember that head last week that we had? Uh, 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 Robbie, or uh, well, one of the boys alluded to it on the bowl show the other night, but we had a, a head there at one stage where we had four, six, eight, ten bowls. Yep. Yeah, there was uh, Leeds second and the first bowl of the third, each third. We had mm. ten bowls, you could have thrown a tablecloth over. Over them, mate. Yeah. Yeah. Well, mate, like, I mean, during Premier League, with the quality of players, though, it's uh, you, you really anticipate yep. this quality of play, though, don't you? You know what I mean? So we've got a bit of line on this one here, Robbie. He's not going to be... Oh, he's just going to pull up. Does that look as though it had good run on it? Look, I can see Bruce's hat. Yes, that's... Uh Make the very special hat cap those ones. Um, I'll yes. put one in the van next time I remember. And next time I see you, Josh, I'll get it out of the van for you. Oh, mate, Josh is too busy doing other stuff and coming and being our raving reporter these days, though, Brizzy. Well, since I retired, I've got a stack of hats left over <laughs> <laughs> from, and key rings from marketing. Oh, <laughs> yeah. uh, uh, dear, oh, dear. Uh, Mind well, you, you can't wear it on a... Uh, that was chipped. For wearing at a social day once, uh, social bowls yeah. on a Saturday. Yeah, it wasn't a BA approved hat. And uh, oh, what have we got in here? There we go. Because it's my old company hat. Yes, it is, yeah. isn't it? Mate, um, well, at least you've got plenty of hats and key rings left over. Right? Yeah. <laughs> When's Jan's birthday? 18 days. <laughs> Hat and a key ring for starters. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, already got 14 hats and 27 <laughs> key rings. <laughs> well, she wants to keep having birthdays. Yeah. That's her problem. Yeah, that's Not right. Not yours. <laughs> yeah. uh, dear. We can say those things because our wives can't hear us. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> we hope. Okay. Robbie, just not going to come back from there. No, no. That's Working good. hard, though. Wherever this finishes could end up being in a very, very good home. Well, it's a good spot there because you know what? It's probably looking at that. Yep. Yeah, it's closest, closest to the uh, to the respot out of all of them. Hey. Well, well, it is too, mate. You can just see the respot just above the uh, yep. bottom of the uh, the screen there. Okay, Johnny. He's just not going to come back in time. No. Going to beat this bowl here, though. No, not quite. Just kept um. running. Here we have it, the Lawn Bowls to you, Premier League 2024 is proudly sponsored by. Yeah, Lawn Bowls to you. Thank you very much. And uh, also BCIB Insurance Brokers and supported by Paradise Point Bowls Club, who, uh, from where the uh, bowl show is hosted, Club Musgrave, they are going to have the finals this year. And Smith & Co, who's the sponsor, the main sponsor of the bowl show. And we thank them all for their participation. Now, Ryan Burnett just picked up a five. Right. Which is going to make it interesting. Huey's not going to come back in time. Not turning, Huey. No. So what do we got there? That uh, red and white Darren Brown still holding yeah. in there. Sounds like Chrissy Rosanna's just played a good bowl too. Stone the crowd. Now, Elaine, is there any chance of you getting hold of uh, Alan? He's way over that far green with all the lollies and telling him to bring him over here, please. Alan? Yes. He's playing. Oh, yeah, Alan's Who's playing. Who's doing the lollies? Yeah. They should have given them to us. We, <laughs> we, we, we could have looked after him. We could have looked after him. Yeah, no, Alan, Alan uh, was a sub for uh, yeah, that's right. young uh, no wonder we Kira when seen she him. left. My God. Oh, no, no, he, she, he didn't sub for Kira. Uh, 
Nathan Heap went Nathan up. Heap went and in. And he for, went in. He went in there. There you right. go. Probably got too much sugar anyway. Bad for him. Yeah. Good, good for us. Yeah. Yeah, that, that fruit. Oh. Right, Huey, closer this time. Oh, Huey, you got a good bowl here, mate. Boy. Oh. What a bowl. Yes. What a great bowl. <laughs> <laughs> Aaron Houston, what that's a bowl. that's taken it back to uh, Aaron's bowl. That's taken it, yes, back to... Um, uh, Robbie's bowl. Robbie's bowl, bowl mate, yes. Yeah. yeah, they changed positions on me. I've got more arrows <laughs> here than, <laughs> than a Western yes. movie. Yes. <laughs> yeah, great bowl there, gee whiz. It's, uh, they're really putting on one heck of a fight back here at the moment. It's back to two shots in it. Yeah, I mean, great shot, but in saying that, had to be very careful. He didn't want to go back any further. Oh, absolutely. Would have been a couple of uh, mate. Yeah, that's Jacob at the back there. Jacob will be trying to sink, yeah. sink the kidney and out also, of there. And uh, John Finlayson. He's close, mate. He's awfully close. Oh, if he hits, 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 and one down. <laughs> yeah, well, that's uh, Trent Healy. Two uh, down. James Templeton. Two down. Well. Yeah. Good pick up there to, uh, to Aaron Hewson. Yeah. And I must admit, like, that change has really uh, got the momentum. Well, that's right. Because well, yeah. they were behind comfortably previously, Bruce. Mm. And it's amazing how a change can change the momentum of a game. And uh, I take your hat off to Robbie Wild that pulled them together for a bit of a team talk. Yeah, yeah. So. Uh, you see the old Pirates starting to get a little bit fired up. <laughs> yeah, that's look, 46 all. Yes, uh, well, it's pretty handy bowls, I'm telling you. What a great game we've got on our hands. Bobby Pritchard watching from Bali at Dempasar oh. Airport. On you, Bob. Yeah, how good's that, mate? Okay, James with his first bowl. Just a little bit underdone grass line. Weight's not too bad. Okay, Darren. Looking pretty good at the moment. Just don't know he's quite got the run to get there, though. Just no. Grass no. line spot on. See, that breeze is picking up a little Jeez, bit. around the corner here, yeah. Yeah, it's and really it's picking cool up a little bit. Actually very comfortable. Yep. Now, yeah. James got a better grass line. Yeah. Much better grass line, but his weight a little bit carried away there. I'm glad you're sitting there. Because <laughs> I'd break it by now. <laughs> You see the reserves there after 52 ends. Capella Bar, 48. Pine Rivers, 45. Mm. Now, Darren, I don't think he's added any more weight to his second bowl. And he's been correcting beautifully so no. far. So things tighten up. Gee whiz, that, and that is unusual for the uh, for the context of this game. Yes. Darren's had one of his two yep. pretty well close. Oh, shit. Oh. And he has. So it's the first time in this game that he's had a bit of a loose end. Now... Trent, he's got to be around these front ones. Yeah, got to miss that front one, buddy. And look, I think I'll take this for a walk. He says, yep. that'll let me. Oh, there you go. And in the main game over on the other green, it's after 56 ends, which is really getting down to the business end. It's uh, Broadbeach 52 to Tweed Heads 49. Again, another good fight back there by yeah. Tweed... Uh, they were down considerably last time they we were, got a report. Yeah. Now, Dave, is he going to sit in his bowl? It'll be awfully close. Oh, oh dear me. Yep. Bad luck, Dave. So, very, very close. Just touched the bowl. See them uh, all getting excited over there. Yeah. Okay, Nelson ducking over to have a look at uh, Brad Piper having a drive. And in the reserves over there, Bruce, it's Tweed Head 60, Bull 66 on 69 ends. Right. So it's close all the way around the park, mate. Oh, another good bowl. Okay, Dave on the mat at the moment. Dave Thomas. Oh, no, Dave, you've got to be out, buddy. 
I, I can see what he was aiming at. Yep. Yeah. Okay, Robbie. Not quite full length, but uh, Matt's up a bit, so. Oh, it's up a good five metres, yeah. Got five metres, mate. Pine Rivers have hit the front, mate. 47 to 46. Yep. Gee whiz, it's close all the way around the park, mate. Oh. Yes. Robbie Wild, great bowl. Incredible bowl. Yeah. I thought that was turning and was going to miss. miss but he just yeah. got the edge of it, mate. Yeah, well done. And the thing I like about it is their enthusiasm and their, you know, they're really, yeah. they're really putting on the intimidation factor now, which is. Uh, I haven't mate. heard this much excitement since they called last drinks at me local. Oh, you're joking! When did <laughs> they do that? <laughs> did the bloke live? <laughs> yeah, help us too this morning. I <laughs> <laughs> uh, hate it when yeah. they send you home early, don't you? <laughs> Okay, John Finlayson. One thing I can tell you, mate, is the intimidation factor won't worry Finno. <laughs> One thing I can assure you. I remember working at the commercial hotel at Bundaberg yep. back in 74, uh, 70, 73, 74. Yep. <laughs> I called last drinks at 10 o'clock and I went to shut the door and a bloke came over, tapped me on the shoulder. He said, we haven't met. <laughs> I'm the sergeant of police, and I'll let you know when it's last drinks. <laughs> <laughs> I've gone, yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> Sorry about that, sir. Yeah, gee whiz. Ah, priceless, mate. Priceless. Yeah. Yes. All right, Finno. I reckon he's got better weight on this. Uh, start to stop, Finno. Be on the right side. <sighs> Not quite. No. Yeah, we could shut the door and shut the windows on the front of the pub, but, geez, as for last drinks, that yeah. went on a little bit, little bit longer. Now, I'm very concerned, though, uh, where these lollies are. I'm sure Alan's got them in his bag over there. How far away is he? I don't know. I reckon we could probably... He's down the far... Yeah. I reckon we could send Robbie. Sacrifice a couple of ends. Oh, there's, there he is. Look, right to the far, walking along. Uh, furthest ring away, mate. Furthest ring, yeah, that's him walking oh, along the... Uh, typical Alan. No? Doesn't care about his mates, like you and me. Uh, he's a good lad, mate. Okay, Huey, what's he got? Uh, I miss it. Oh, bad luck, buddy. Yeah, they're very deep ditches, and I can, it's just hard to see the top of the bowl there. Uh, yeah, uh, from when you're looking down that way. Okay, Jacob, sticking to his backhand. Uh, got the run, saddle. Oh, no. Gee whiz, that started to pull up. And... Shot. Great bowl. bowl. Great bowl. Great bowl. Definitely shot. I'm sure Finno's already had a talk to though, Jacob, about being on the live streaming and not having a shave this morning. <laughs> Thought he could have at least bought a razor. Okay, Huey. Looks like he's going to have a bit of a look at it. He's let it go. Oh. Move, move, move. What's it got? Oh, well, that's... That, yeah, yeah that'll that, be shot. Yeah, did it roll it over? Yep. 
I can't see. Well, I think Jacob, well, I'm not too sure. No, I'd say that the light blue coloured one yeah. has to be uh, that's rolled across there. That one there, there that we one go. There. Um, that's, um, whose is that one? Uh, um, uh, that's Trent Healy's, is it? It's a toucher too, though, mate. Mm. Oh, yeah. Canes can only get a little bit animated out there too, just yeah. quite. Chris Rosanna's played a bomb, but Kane just played a better bomb. Yeah, so the only way, I mean, no point knocking that in because it's mm. a toucher. He's got to knock it away in him. Yeah, he's got to get the edge of it, mate. Yep, here we go. Oh, oh, no. backspin. Like just the one. Yeah, one to pine. Yep. And we've got new leaders. We've got Pine back in front there, 18 to 16. So it's been a well, it's very grinding like that first game which Gary Kelly did. Um, yeah. Bruce, wasn't he? Just ground and ground and ground. And uh, very similar. Ryan Burnett and Dylan Fisher, 19 all. <laughs> There's 13-11 uh, uh, to uh, Chris Rosanis over Kane Nelson. And this one, 18-16. So definitely going to go down to the wire. This I can assure you. Well, the reserves, 55-54. Yep. Great starter there from yeah. James. First up also too. Yeah, oh, mate, you've got uh, two great teams here, so... Really should go down the wire. Now, Brownie, you think when he let that go would be way too tight. Beautiful weighted bowl there by uh, by yeah. Darren. A little bit wider, and he uh, he was in a good spot there. Yep. James chasing his bowl up, and he's yep. got another good one here. Well done, James. Yeah, two very good bowls there, yep. mate. Yeah, uh, uh, Daniel Doherty, game on. It certainly is. Especially with uh, oh, only 13 ends to go, which oh. effectively is roughly four ends. Uh, yep. Mind you, Kane and Chris are lagging behind a little bit. Yes. 15 ends. But it's been a colossal game, though, uh, Daniel, hasn't it, sir? Bowls have been absolutely first class. Now Trent Healy sticking to his backhand. You still see there's still a good crowd in behind them. Yeah, well done there, uh, yep. Trent. And that's what um, Jacob's asking. Play weight to that white bowl, please, David. And pick up the kitty on the way. Easy instructions. Now yeah, Trent really's got to put Ooh. one around the back here, mate, and cover that uh, they, these bowls back here. Good call by Huey. Just said put a bit more weight to it, mate. Hey, Trent. Sticking to his backhand. Missed that front, and you've got a great bowl, buddy. Oh, well, he's, he's really made a target now, though, mate. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, onto that one he just brought yeah. down. Any yeah. any movement on that will take the... I think Dave will probably play weight here, mate. Yeah, it will take the 9 o'clock and the 3 o'clock bowl out, I'd say. Yep. Yeah, we will see where they go. Kitty gone. One, two, three. No, I took two out, yeah. He did it three, nine. I said yeah. nine, three. three. So. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but that that was on the cards because of the position of the, the, the of those bowls. bowls. Yeah. I mean, I'd still be looking just to put one around the back for a bit of safety sake here. Even though I don't think they'll go the bear, Keddy. Now it's open enough to dead mm. draw it, you know. 
I mean, you can still put one in there, third shot, and still count, but just in behind the head. Yeah, see, Robbie... Uh, Hold your head up, Robbie. Ah, uh, never mind. I think Fenno just dead draw it. Okay, Fino on the back end, trying to dead draw it. A little bit under done grass line. Yeah, trying to go out. Yeah. There's yeah. two blue bowls there that are holding uh, first and second shot. So they're at um, uh, Jane Templeton's, aren't they? Yes, they're both yeah, James's yeah. mate, yes. Great bowl there. Uh, so this, you know, I mean, this this three, trouble is there's still a target there. Mm. I think they'll try and dead draw it though, mate. I don't think they'll try and hit it. I think that uh, a dead draw and moving the jack, yeah, back in six inches behind those. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that's handy. I mean, Robbie's just gone back. Uh, maybe a bit of protection out there with that uh, uh, that yep. bowl of um, of Darren Browns. No, is it going? What to go big? Okay. Well, I thought if they just drew that off, back to here, they'd have three shots, mate. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. But anyway. They're playing the game. I'm not. Simple as. Well, Fino, Ooh, that's narrow. Fino, that's narrow. Yeah. Oh, hang on a sec. Yeah, you've well, got, got one another. out. Yeah. What's the score in the Broadie and Tweed reserves? Um, Last score we had... Was 66 to Bulls and 60 to Tweed. And yep. that's after 69 ends. Right. That's the last score we had given to us. And uh, I can tell you right now, it's 71 all from what I can see. And I'm not too sure if it's the Bulls, the first to 71. Or the offsprays, but I can see 71 all. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Huey. Mate, I'd be covering those bowls if I was you, Aaron. Oh, I can't see the ends, mate. How many ends? 78 ends and 71 all. Turn under, Huey. Turn under, Huey. Ah, oh, bad luck, mate. Yeah, good effort. Yep. We only need one at the round there, though. Jacob now. Anything even in behind their head, mate, is all capella bar. They've got mm. things covered in every direction. Well, see, at the moment you've got um, Trent Healy holding mm. shot, but then you've got purple of uh, Robbie Wild, and then here we go. And now the purple of Robbie Wiles holding uh, shot. Holding shot. Now, geez, I, I fancy that bowl of Huey's just on the angle there to be uh, maybe second shot. I'm just having a look up there. It could uh, be. Yeah. Well, maybe not. Could be, mate. Could be. You never yeah. know. Well, anyway, we'll see what they play. Or... You always got plenty of room to add to it, mate. Oh, by all means. Yep. If he's going to miss these, he's on a great line. Keep rolling, Huey. Yeah, well done. <laughs> I 
Nice little trail on there for, for Jacob, mate, if he wanted it. Mm. Yep. On Jacob's backhand. Yeah. 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 Got a few waiting for it, mate. Well, you got two of uh, Darren's for starters. Yep. All right, he's in the area. They agree the absolute are instead. Yeah, I'll One take shot. Your shot. Good yeah. ball. Yeah. Well played, Jacob Nelson. Yes, sir, Bob. Okay, hot off the press, ladies and gentlemen, on behalf of Phil Jordan, Musgrave beat a Nogra, 71 to 42. And Penguins are up. Pelicans, Penguins, all the same to me, mate. <laughs> Starts with P. Yeah, flightless bird. <laughs> flightless bird. <laughs> Musgrave beat a Nogra, Musgrave won on two rinks. Jeez, that's got to be close. Yeah, just running through the head. Oh, just running across the head there with James. Oh, great ball there by Brownie. Yeah, good correction. Yeah. yeah. Great correction. Actually, this is the second last end. I, I was looking at the other. Th yeah, so this is the 19th end. Yeah. 20th I, end. I was looking at that too. I said, gee whiz, they've really got through this game. Hmm. That guy's... David, now this is one shot in it, really down to the last few ends, and Huey's got to keep it nice and tight. Another good-looking bowl here coming in from David Thomas. He's got in a good second shot. Yep, two shots. Good call by Huey. I don't care. I don't care which hand you play to get shot. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> I love Huey's. Yeah. You can come this way or this way as long as you got shot. shot. Yeah, I don't mind. Played this pretty well too, just quietly, Trent. Oh, just running past. That's a very good bowl, mate. Yeah, great bowl here. Oh, I don't want to move it, Dave. Oh, he stuck it out in the open, though. Mm. Got to rock this down, I think, because that's um, that's James's bowl. That's mate. James's bowl, yeah. And they've got good catchment bowls there now too, haven't they, uh, Bruce Shinnerman? Yeah. So uh, I 
Mm. Okay. John Finlayson looking to dead draw this. He's not going to be too far away. It's looking pretty good to sit this bowl out of the head. Has he got the edge of it? Yep. He has. Played it beautifully. And he played it with good weight too, didn't he? He didn't go quick at it. No, no. He well, he just, just rolled it up sufficient yeah. to, to casually knock it out and, and sit the shot with uh, Darren's bowl. Jeez. Ryan Burnettley took off then. Did he? Yes. <laughs> he was flying up the green. <laughs> okay, Robbie. Has oh, Robbie, you got a bit short, mate, on this. Oh, no, it's holding out. Unbelievable. What a great bowl. <laughs> well played. <laughs> I thought that was going to finish up play, mate. <laughs> it yeah. just kept running. That was a great bowl there by Robbie Wild. Right, Finno once again. He says, okay, put it back now, son. Yeah. There you go. Yeah, Finno's got the advantage. He can reach down to the head. <laughs> <laughs> I'm pretty, was pretty sure. Let's see how good your memory is, son. Oh. Had luck, Great right. attempt. Good, good ball there, yeah. though. Yeah. A pine just got the bit of a jump on um, Capella Bar here. All right, Jacob, hold your head out there, buddy. You got a good bowl. He's just got to start great to bowl, pull mate. Up. Yeah, just get around that. Yeah, beautiful bowl there from Jacob Nelson. See, we're fortunate enough that uh, the end's short enough. We can actually look out live and yep. see where they're finishing. Huey, is he there? Oh, other side, Huey. Oh, not quite. Bad luck. Yeah. Very close. Yeah. Right in the reserve grade here, you can see Pine 67 to Capalabar 61. After 72 ends. Two ends to go over in the main game. And it's Broadbeach 55, Tweed Heads 53. Getting closer and closer, Bruce. It is. And you've got here yeah, Pine Rivers 54 51 over Capella Bar, yep. and uh, a few ends to go. I mean, this is the last end for uh, the live stream um, match. Um. Some great games. Well, no, it's not second last end. Yeah, yeah, we've second got last to, we've end. Got to go back the other way. Yeah, Jacob gone for a bit of cover here. Doesn't want to rock this one in. Mm. Whose bowl is that? I don't think it's Jacobs, is it? No. No. Oh, nobody. There's a penalty flag on the day. <laughs> <laughs> and in the Reggies over there, mate, which is still going on a couple of rinks, believe it or not, there's been a huge fight back here. The Offsprays, uh, 76 to the Bulls, 74 on 82 ends. Oh, With geez. two ends to play, so it's close all over the board, mate. Is it what? Close all over the board, mate. And great bowls here. Huey holding one here. Where's well, he got the right? He don't want to give it away. Did you hear no. Huey there? <laughs> I'm not there. Why? Well, I don't want to give it away. Yep. Wonder Pine. Yep. Okie dokie. Last end to go, ladies and gentlemen. What a great game this has been also. It has too, been. Mate. Yeah. It's been a colossal game of bowls. An absolute congratulations to all the players. 
They're um, been absolutely brilliant watching this game. Thanks, Nico. Thanks, buddy. And Ian Johnson uh, is watching. Thanks, Ian. Hey, okay, Ian. Good start here from James Templeton. Yes. Keep rolling on, my boy. That's a great yeah, first up bowl, mate. Great first up bowl. Okay, James back on the mat. <laughs> hey, Wedgie, how are you, buddy? How'd you go, mate? Hope you had a win. Now, James, is he around this bowl? I don't think he is. No, he's oh. just... Uh... Uh, yeah, uh, is that Gene, is it? Yeah, they have. Uh, they've changed the uh, skip. Uh, Robbie Wilde was skipping and uh, Aaron's now skipping. Uh, yep. Robbie's gone to third. But they also did change uh, uh, lead and second. Uh, James Templeton went to lead and Trent came down to second. So they've changed there, Gene. It's been an incredible game. We see a good bowl here from Trent Healy too, just quietly. Not going to be too far away. That's a great bowl by Trent. Yep. Well done. Yep. And a knocker. Well and done. A knocker. Well done, Trent. Hey, good on you, Wedgie. You had a win. Good on you, buddy. Great catching up with you today too, mate. Okay. Oh, no, he said he got thrashed. No, he the won't. The previous comment. Oh, sorry, I beg your pardon. <laughs> I didn't read that one. <laughs> yeah, okay, mate. Sorry about that, buddy. Yeah. Yeah, lovely ball there. Uh, that's uh, uh, Dave Thomas's ball. Yep, good ball there by Dave too. Just quietly, mate. Okay, yeah. Trent. How's good is how good is his memory, mate? He's just got to get inside that bowl of uh, of Dave's. Yep. Ah, g'day, Tam. Tam Greg watching from Scotland. Oh, okay. Oh, stay a straight line. Yeah, that's a good bowl. Yeah. <laughs> okay, mate. <laughs> okay, I understand now, uh, Wedgie. He played against Wendy Wilson. <laughs> <laughs> she can play the game, mate. I'm telling you, I've seen Wendy play a fair bit over the years, Greg, yeah. and uh, <laughs> she's given plenty of people a touch-up, mate. Uh, <laughs> yeah. There she goes. All right, Wendy. Okay, Dave, what's he going to have a bit of a look at this, is he? Yes, he is. Yeah, but oh, he's got a bit. He's got to come off a couple. There we go. Oh, well, he's taking his own out, so he's three down now. Yeah, <laughs> he's Didn't taking his own out. Yeah, because you've got uh, 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 James Templeton's bowl there yep. on the left. Yeah, but those two of um, yep of of Trent. Like Kane played a good ball over there. Hmm. Like Ryan Burness played a bomb on the rink next door. <laughs> Gee whiz, I tell you what, there's great balls everywhere you look here. What happened? Yeah, I just saw the end result. Oh, Robbie Wild, what a ball. Yeah, well done, Robbie. One, two, three, four. What did Kane pick up? 15 all. Uh, the, the score's gone to after mm. 18. Yep. Yeah, I don't think they've done it board yet, have they? Uh, 16, 17, 18. May not have been. Which way are they heading? 
Oh, they, that way yeah. on the 18th. Yeah. Yeah, no, that'd be. Not in 2021. Yeah. yeah. Okay, problem is here they're four down. So uh, last end here in this game. It's been a colossal game between Jacob Nelson and Robbie Wold and then Aaron Houston took over and then they changed the leads. Yeah. Everybody swapped around. Yeah. Okay, Fino, how's he looking? Oh, it's just his weight. He's going to take a couple out if he keeps running. Great bloke for you know, mate, really yeah. is. And uh, seen him play a lot of bowls over the years and he's just such an easy bloke to play with, you know. Looks like it's still four, though. Still four at this stage, mate. That'll be handy on the master board if Whoa. they can... Uh, I don't think they'll end up oh, four, no. though. Oh, no, fine. <laughs> oh, they, they won't end up <laughs> They'll end up four, mate, somehow. No. But, um, yeah, absolute top bloke for you know. There's only the one rink still going over there. And... Um, not too sure. Could be Alan Vidler's uh, rig because he's been stopping off to eat all the lollies. Oh, lolly, yeah, that'd be lolly right. Lollies will turn it in. Okay, where's this going, Robbie? No, he's not down there. Well, it's given something to land on now, so I think he's just told Finno. I think he's just got to draw it, mate. He's got to cut him down. You've got to look at the master board. Yeah, 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 yeah. You've got to look at the master board. Finno's more than capable of... of oh, he's starting to cut the... Cutting early. Yeah. Oh, dear. Onto that. Oh. 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 Not quite. <laughs> okay, it's... Uh, it's all over over there. It's um, Broad Beach, Bull 61, Tweed Head... Ospreys, 53. So a good win to Broad Beach over there. G'day, Carmen. How are you this afternoon? Carmen McCloskey. She would absolutely be barracking for Capella Bar, I can guarantee you that, mate. <laughs> On you, Carmen. Okay, Huey. Uh, only a couple of ends to go. A couple of vessels leading up very well over there by the looks of it. Well, as I said, that is just drawing the shot. Okay, Huey, what have you got, son? Around the back. I think he just covered the spot, mate. I think he's, uh, he'd probably be on the spot. Oh, well, geez, he's <laughs> close there and he's there. Well, they can't really go quick at it for the kill. I think no, he's got it. He can't get at it. Well, even if he beats those back bowls, he could end up with second shot, which gives his team that's still got a few ends to play an opportunity. I mean, gee whiz, what a colossal game. Like, I mean, Ryan Burnett, 24 20 went over Dylan. Fisher, uh, you know, 19 17 in this game. Like, it's just been incredible bowls all the way through. Yeah, Jacob's got to play to those two purple bowls. Mate, he's played this pretty well. And, and, and take second shot. He's going to ease the pain here. What a great bowl by Jacob Nelson. That's a very good bowl, mate. Yeah. That's a class player. Like, he's at least five down there, I reckon, Bruce. What do you One, reckon? Two, three, four, five, yep. And that's to get second shot out of that. I reckon he's done very, very well. I mean, I wouldn't be going silly here if I was them. I'd be looking at the master board and say, look, we had one more here. They've only got a couple of ends to go over there between Kane and uh, Chris. Yep. It, uh, it's really quite realistic it's, but because, because J Jacob's got too much room to draw another one. So he's just, just over a draw. We're not going real quick, mate, you know what I mean? Yeah, look, you played either hand. You played on your forehand, mate. Because if you if you if you a bit narrow, you're going to knock that other bowl up on the line. Because the last thing he wants is an outside edge. Oh, is he take? Oh, no. yeah. as I said, the last thing he wants was an outside edge, <laughs> <laughs> which he would have got. <laughs>
Okay, Jacob. Making up his mind what he's going to play. Mate, what a great day of bowls we've had here. And we've got a double hit again next weekend too, buddy. Yep, yep. And Jacob's done the right thing. He's uh, he's just drawn another one, mate. Yeah, no use going for a wrap. Yep. It, 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 it's not going to help. Uh, there we go. Hands being shaken. Well, he sacrificed his rink to try and keep the, the score within a gettable, uh, with a few ends to play. Well, mate. that's right, yeah. And that's, yep. that, to me, is a team player. I've seen too many skips over the years too worried about their own rink. Oh, yeah, how'd I go? Oh, I won. Well, I won. Yeah, yeah, yeah. On the master board, yeah. we were down the other two. Yeah. 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 Like, I remember playing with a chap one day. We were playing at Surface Paradise, and uh, we were two up overall, and he was one down on the head, and he had one. And he had the last bowl. And he chased his rink and we dropped the three to lose, <laughs> to lose because he was chasing his own rink. Yeah, yeah. You know. No, I've seen it too often, mate, so yep. that's, you know. Okay, well done, Aaron. Well, let's call it the combined uh, Robbie Wild, Aaron Houston uh, led uh, combination. Lead of the series. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Dumped him as a lead. Yeah. Uh, he did really well, Trent. He played yeah. really well. But that's a great game, mate. Like, you can't beat, uh, you know, it's just a gem of a game. A couple of shots in it. The fight back was there. Jacob got out to a great start. The momentum changed when they changed things around, really, didn't it, Bruce? You know what I mean? Yep. The momentum changed. Now, obviously, Kane's had a latch at this. We're just going to keep this going for a little bit longer, ladies and gentlemen. I was just wondering why they respotted. They didn't go out. Yeah, they killed it. Yeah. It was still rolling across. It was out. Yeah. Well, he picked it up inside the uh, the two mark the marker there. So down to the skips, Chris Rosanis got plenty of room. To draw. He's drawn it, I'd say. Randy Kane's Cummins. walking. Yep. Yeah, what a great ball. No. No, he's saying one. No. It's a different ring. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Well, it does. You just ask him to move. It's quite simple. No. Oh. You just got to take one step. Beautiful. Okay, Kane looking to draw this. More than capable. Yeah, what a great bowl. Great bowl there by Kane. He's only left him a couple of feet. Now, yeah, will Chris change his hand to get round that bowl? Or will he stick to the same hand? I think he'll stick to the same hand. Even if he comes around that front one of his... Yeah, I know, because they're standing there. I can see that, yeah. That matters only one end a couple of ends ago anyway. So Ryan Burnett down. One bowl each left by the skips. Right, Chris looking to dead draw this. What a great attempt. Great effort. Great effort. Just the one down. Uh, it's well played there by Chris. Now, Riley <laughs> puts the mat down on the tee, first up. Not too sure on what's happening on the rink next door. I think Rhino might be down.
Not quite. We'll see what happened over there. Well, Rhino's pretty happy, so I say he's probably, yep, one to uh, Pine Rivers, so that's handy pick up there to Ryan Burnett and Riley Garrick. What a great first up bowl. Nothing wrong with that. Who's that on? Uh, it's Breeny, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, Michael Breen, mate. Pretty handy first up bowl too, just quietly, Bruce. Look at this. Ah, uh, good bowl. Breamy. Pine River specialist, mate. Yeah, well, certainly has plays uh, uh, in the uh, BPL. Oh, yeah. he was he playing. He was, mate, yeah. was playing. Had a great couple of series too, just quietly. Mm. Yeah. Then I think he's the manager now, isn't he? Yeah, 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 yeah. Look at young Riley, though. Gee whiz. Oh, unlucky. Unlucky. Just about on track there with that one. It just caught Breamy's bowl. They've just got a couple of ends to go, and there's uh, six shots in it. We're trying to show it to you, ladies and gentlemen. You've got to understand the cameras aren't behind the rink, so we're doing the best we can. Yeah, a little bit wide with that one there, Michael. Is that a final score? Okay, final score over there in the Reggies. Tweed Heads, 79. Broadbeach, 74. So a good win to Tweed over there. Well done, Tweed Heads. Okay, Alfie Boston on the mat at the moment. Alfie not far away. Has he got the kitty? Well, he's made three out of that. Great bowl by Alf. Hmm. Okay, Caitlin trying to cut it down. Chris Rose Ennis is having a good look at this. Yeah, good ball by Caitlin. One shot. Well played. Uh, Caitlin, of course, just back from the Trans Tasman over in New Zealand. Getting pretty close here in the Regis too at 74-72 on 80 ends. Four ends to go. Two shots in it. Pine Rivers, two shots in front. Right. Alf with his second bowl. Looking for a trail. Not far away. Two great bowls here from Alfie Boston. Um, I don't know. Uh, Don, I wasn't listening. Um, uh, Dan, sorry. How the Broady uh, uh, reserves end up? Uh, went down... Uh, Brody, uh, yeah. Brody went down, 79-74. 79-74. So, Tweed Heads. Yeah. Tweed Heads had a win over there, mate. I'm sure there'll be a lot of players that are going to sleep very well tonight. <laughs> Too right. Big, Big day. day. Yeah. Big day for them, mate. Now, Caitlin, just a bit wide with that one. So, Cody, looking for a trail here. Bruce, if he can trail that kid, he could end up with four shots. I favour them for, well, I'm not too sure if Caitlin's still got shot or Alfie's got shot with that back bowl. But, um, of course, Chris has claimed it for shot before Alfie played that bowl. So, Cody looking for a little trial. Kane reckons he's a bit quick. Right, Mark Armstrong. Poppy should slow down. There's no need for him to run. No, don't need that. We've got all night. Yes. No need to panic. Okay, 
So Broadbeach fought back after defeat this morning for a win. This head set here is pretty nice set up here for uh, for Capella Bar. They've got a mm. couple of good catches in behind. Oh, he's in the pack. Yep. Right, Cody Garrick. Big chance here. Trail the kitty. Could have four shots. And if he gets four shots on this end, mate, it's game one for the last end. No, just it's cutting like across. going to cut. Yes, it is. Yep. Mm. Good weighted bowl there, though, Bruce, when you look at it. Oh, yeah. Just yeah. very narrow, yeah, buddy. Exactly what you said, mate. So, Mark... This is the hard part because you're not behind it. You can't see what's where it is, can you, mate? You know what I mean? Okay, suck over to his forehand. Very, very good player, Mark Armstrong. Just passed. Well, that's where um, Chris Rosanna's wanted to bowl, really, so he got it there. Right, Kane Nelson. Now, this is what the game's actually made for. For Kane. More than capable of playing the big bowl here. Okay, Kane, he's let it go. He likes it. He's following it. He's not far away. Just a bit runny. Uh, just around the back there. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty good attempt there, though, mate. Geez, he wouldn't mind it falling over. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Right, Chris. What's he got? What hand's he going to play, mate? I've, I've, been, I've been trying to play backhand onto that bowl of Caitlin's. It's on the run. Mm. But as I said, it's hard because we're not behind the rink to really... See the way it's set up. You're trying to move my head around, <laughs> around to, to, <laughs> to, 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 as if I'm as if I'm behind it. Yeah. No, he's playing his forehand. Okay. Hasn't quite got the run. Eighty five, eighty four at the moment to Capella Bar. Uh, eighty one ends. Seventy five, seventy four. Yep. Okay, Kane Nelson looking for a trail. Or to sip this red bowl out of the head. Just ducking a little bit. Mm. Yep, there it is. Yep. Well, Capella Bar uh, in the Reggies have they just picked up a... Picked up a handful of all sorts, mate. Yeah. They're carrying on. Want to be more than one shot anyway. <laughs> well, I'm having a look at the... the Someone will have a heart attack down there, mate. <laughs> what is it, 25-18 or something on that scoreboard, yeah. is it? Uh, I think it's... Not too sure. It could be 26 20, I think. No, that one's finished. That's that one there. Yeah, it's that one there. You know, it is 25 13, mate. Yeah. yeah. Okay, Chris Rosanna's going to play this bowl, which tells me that they must be down because if they had that one shot, Bruce, he'd just take it. Oh, yeah. He'd take yeah. it for one end to play. So he must be down on the head and looking just a dead draw. It definitely doesn't want to trail the kitty, I can assure you of that. Definitely does not want to take his red bowl out of the head, otherwise, he'd drop a few. Looking pretty good. Chris Rosanis. Good bowl here. Ooh, did it? No. One shot. That's a great bowl, mate. Yep. That's a great bowl, Bruce. Mate, you don't get much better than that. 
Chrissy yeah. Rosanus. One to Pine. Yep. So that's 16 all after 20. Got to have a winner, mate. Yep. Going to have a winner after this one. Right. Michael Boom on the mat at the moment. Chris is uh, pretty happy with that one, mate. As he should be. So Bream, he said, let's have a short one. It's been a uh, very successful day, Bruce, for the uh, Pine River Pirates. It has been. Um, two wins, two from two. Uh, it's a pretty successful day, mate. And a successful day for the uh, the new format for uh, Premier League's oh. uh, uh, double headers. Mate, I spoke to a lot of players this morning, Bruce, and everybody was just so positive about it, mate, that, you know, they've uh, to get the games over and done with in one day, they're, they're more than happy. Gives them a bit of time to, uh, you know, do have what they want to do. Have a game tomorrow. tomorrow at their club. Yeah. <laughs> instead of, <laughs> yeah, dead right. Instead of going with the family. Well, most of yeah. them, in actual fact, are playing club championships. Yeah, well, that's that's the other thing. Yeah. They've great enabled there. club championships to get in. Yeah, great bowl there, Riley. Going to be a uh, great player, isn't he, Riley? Like he's only just 16 years of age. Yeah. Continually playing at this level, and he, he every time I see him, he's. Always been a very, very steady player, but every time I see him, he just seems to be improving. So Good demeanour also. Oh, mate, yeah, absolutely. Got to put a house brick on his head, though, stopping growing. Yeah, yeah, he's getting taller, isn't he? <laughs> he is, mate. Look at Lacey. <laughs> yeah. Mind yeah. you, at the Junior Championships up at Bundaberg, yep. he wasn't the tallest. Yeah, there was a lot of blo blokes taller than him. Yeah, and that's true, too. Right, Riley with this one, just dropping good weighted bowl there once again. G'day Tony, hey boys, good win for the Tigers today. Good on you mate. Okay, Caitlin, not... We're oh, just going to pull up. Pulling up. Yep, it is. Yep. Look at that line again, though. Just absolutely perfect. Yeah, just bring around the back a little bit, if you wouldn't mind. Yeah. Hey, good on you, Tony. Well done, too, to the Tigers. It's going to finish up in a pretty good home, but looks it. Yep. Yep. Oh, oh, I thought that was going to run past. Made two there, I reckon, mate. Mm-hmm. Okay, Caitlin Inch. As I said, a bit like Chloe Stewart, fresh from the Grand Tasman. Yes. I think they got back on Monday, mate, if I remember correctly, from over in New Zealand. A bit short with that one, but I'd put it down to jet lag. <laughs> and, a, and a full day's bowls. And a full day's bowls, mate. Two games. Yeah, I'd definitely put games. it down to jet lag, mate. So down to the last couple of bowls. Got this one here. Alfie Boston. Just going to sneak around the back. Handy bowl there from Alfie, though. He's yep. done his damage. They've got two shots. Well, one of them is off in the in yeah. the in the in the head there anyway. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Alfie's, well, they got two there, mate, haven't they? Yep. So. Yeah. I mean, I don't think Pine's going to be too concerned unless they look as though they're about to drop seven or shots or something. Yeah, them, I don't think so. Yeah, they may get a bit concerned. No. Okay, Mark Armstrong.
Uh, just a bit of a promotion up there. Yep. Right, Cody. Sticking to his forehand, looking to add to it. Looking pretty handy. Just starting to cut the head slightly by the looks of it. He's going to... Uh, oh, and... <laughs> no, not quite. But she's going to roll a uh, healthy Boston's bowl over yeah. there. I don't think Mark would want to go big at this, but I think he wouldn't mind just trying to split those two, mate. You know what mm. I mean? But once again, when you're looking at the big board at the overall... Yep. Through. Oh. oh. Well, that's basically where uh, Chris said, yep, heard that then. Mm. Good. So obviously Chris is going to split those two, mate, I reckon. Yeah. Uh. Having a good conversation about it? Yeah. I really, there's not much more you can do, mate. Just go down there and draw a shot, mate. Well, that's right. That's right. Well, looking for differential, but, uh, yeah. I mean, there's seven shots there, and then... They're not going to get seven. They're not going to get seven shots in yeah. a big fit. No. Um, uh, just... What, what Kane's called for was a good good shot. Just roll that ball over once. And that takes the split away from um, from Chris, mate. Like, he's set up for the split. Yeah. Still on. Type of weight Chris plays with here into the head. Could be interesting. Just a, a metre through the head. Well, Chris could even back himself in to draw this too, though. More than capable. I think he's backed himself on the draw here, Bruce. Yeah, it'll come into view on our top left hand there in a second. There it is. Oh, oh. Mate. <laughs> mate, what a bowl. What a bowl. That's a great bowl by Chris. Right, Kane. G'day, Lynn, or Max, whoever's uh, using the device at home there. I'd say it's probably Maxie using Lynn's data. <laughs> I know, Maxie. Okay, Kane. Yeah, just there. I'm trying to turn this over. G'day, Mark. How are you, mate? Well, 
Well, he's probably got three shots there, I reckon, mate. Yeah, well, you've got Alfie's. Yep. How you going, Mark? Hope you're keeping well, mate. See so you had a bit of a trip to New Zealand. Having a good talk about it. I can't see the why. Yeah. <laughs> That's my point. Yeah. I mean, they're, they're down seven on the board overall. They're I'd, probably I'd say that uh, Capalaba may have a couple there. Yep. Which isn't going to make that much of a difference to it. And there's one bowl to come. From Only home. one. One bowl each, is it? Where are yeah. we? Oh, there we go. Yeah, all right, okay. Oh, pine, happy. Happy chappies. Hey, good on you, Mark. Glad to, you enjoyed it, mate. Played at Moolabar today. Okay, mate. Would have been pretty quick there on a cool day like today, mate. Okay, Chris made up his mind. Chris. He'd be backing himself just a dead draw again, mate. Yeah, it could well be. Has he gone out wide enough there? No. No. Well, there you go. Two draws in one day, mate. Yep. At least they didn't lose. No. Hey. No. no. Okay, Kane Nelson. Probably holding. What do you reckon, mate? Two or three? Yeah, well, uh, Elfie's might have, what, one. Who's just that? Uh, that's Kane's uh, bowl, the... Uh, yep. Uh, that, that's no. not quite there. But a good win to Kane. Good win yeah. to Kane, so well done. So, the end of the game. What a great day we had there, too. It's uh, absolutely first class. Uh, first double header for the year, Bruce. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. mate, definitely um, what was expected. Absolutely uh, incredible day, mate. It's just measuring now to see, uh, see the damage. Yeah. Uh, looking for the seventh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so yeah. Um, this morning's game, as we said, um, Tweed Heads, Tweed Heads um, 45 and um, Pine Rivers 58. And um, Jacob, well, Capella Bar 63, Broad Beach 55. In the Reggies. The reserves, the Pirates, 88, Osprey, 65. And in the other one was 87 all, which is uh, Capalabar versus Broadbeach. Now, this afternoon's games, we've got Broadbeach, 61, to Tweed Heads, 53. In the reserve grade, we've got Tweed Heads, 79, to the Bulls, 74. And this game here, as we said, we have got the winners to... Pine Rivers, 61 over 56 to Capalabar. And in the Reggies, 77 all. So two draws today. Yeah, it's, it's amazing, that. Yeah, well, it's been pretty close games, though, Bruce, hasn't it? You know, and it's been um, been some great bowls played, mate. Well, we've showcased um, uh, uh, well, two games today, and they, they, they've both been good games to uh, to live stream, oh. I must add. And uh, very good. Absolutely, mate. Now, uh, of course, this wonderful event could not be brought to you if it wasn't for the sheer generosity of these wonderful sponsors, and we thank them very much yeah. for their uh, sponsorship. Yeah, Lawn Bowls to you, a major sponsor of the Premier League Queensland 2024. Lawn Bowls to you, thank you. 
and BCIB Insurance Brokers. And they're supported by a couple of ancillaries there on the bottom. You've got Club Musgrave, who are hosting the finals weekend. Uh, you've got uh, Paradise Point, who uh, hosts the Bowl Show uh, venue. And the Bowl Show sponsor, uh, which is Smith & Co Realty. We thank them for their participation. Absolutely, mate. And, of course, some long bowls to you. We've got a wonderful stock of backpacks. Two right, $65 available in store down there at Fane Street, down at Manly at the Manly Bowls Club. Info at lawnbowls.2u.com.au. Thank you very much. Peter Shaw down there at Capalabar Sports Club, 0401 Yes, we thank Thanks, them Peter. very much. And what a great day. Good crowd here. It's been a uh, great day of bowls, mate. The camaraderie, the uh, the whole lot. I think everything's been on display today. It's not the sportsmanship, the... Uh, Mate, you name it, it's all been uh, showcased and what an absolutely incredible day of bowls. We've got some great games. Look forward to... Uh, so with that, on behalf of the Gold Coast Tweed District Media Team, ably led by Mr Robbie Allen and uh, myself, Brian Marshall, and co-commentator Bruce Kirk, we wish you good bowling on air again next Saturday, ladies and gentlemen. Enjoy your bowls and support your club. Bye for now.